If you want to enter your design, just send a photo to studio at jewelrymaker.com or you can post your photos to Jewelry Maker Studio, Ivy House, Henley Road, Studley, B80, 7DU. And make sure you don't forget your customer number. Get making and good luck. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry makers, we have some important news to tell you about. On Tuesday the 26th of June, Jewelry Maker is moving home on Freeview to Channel 74. Don't forget that you might need to retune your Freeview box. This should only take a few minutes. So, from the 26th of June, you'll find Jewelry Maker on Freeview, Channel 74. Because how are we all? Ombre, ole. I don't know why I feel like I need to do that. Do a bit of a Spanish. Ole. Um, got a bit of a funny story about that one actually. Just come back from Spain, as some of you may well know. Anyway, with uh, with with some of our family, and bless her heart, Tom's uh, my husband's cousin. So we're ordering food at this restaurant, and um, they do really lovely pizzas. And um, my, I won't I won't mention her name, but she actually said, "Yeah, I'm going to have that pizza, please. The Ollie, the Ollie pizza." So we're like, "I think it's Ole." <laughs> <laughs> That's the kind of thing that I would come out with. I've got to be honest. I've got to be honest. Yeah, I'll have the Ole pizza, please. <laughs> <laughs> the Ole. Come on now. Let's get a bit cultural. Um, how are we all, folks? I hope you've had a wonderful weekend. Um, it is Monday morning, and my goodness, have we got an amazing lineup for you today. Um, natural Australian diamonds. Yeah, incredible. And they are breathtakingly beautiful. If you've never had the chance to actually see those with us yet, um, we launched them not that long ago. Incredibly, incredibly popular because they are, like I said, absolutely beautiful. Um, we have got, I think, one of the most um, luxurious kits as well. We, I was lucky enough to bring it to you with wonderful Claire um, a few weeks ago. So maybe you were on your holidays or you, you weren't able to watch at that time. So we're going to repeat that. The pieces of jewellery that um, Claire created, stunning. Oh, they're always stunning, aren't they? Let's be honest. Your deal of the day, oh wait until you see it. a vision of amazing garnet and lemon quartz it's a beautiful combination it's not yet here in the studio um, so you're gonna have to wait for a little while but it'll be here very very soon um, really beautiful combination together I've got chrome diopside coming your way I've got the DVD relaunch or I should say um, Claire's it's Claire's DVD that we brought to you on the um, in the birthday box set um, so you have been asking jewelry makers for them to be actually separated and we've done it for you basically um, so if you wanted to get hold of Claire's wire prong setting DVD your chance is upon us today we're bringing you this at 9:30. oh nine o'clock before the kit so that's coming up at nine o'clock and by the way it'll be amazing alongside the kits too so that's coming up but let's say hello to the gorgeous lady that is to my right um she is fabulous and i always take the mickey out of her but she knows i love her really <laughs> Oh, I love you. I love you. I love you more. No, I don't think you do. I'm sure I love you a whole lot more. Oh, thanks. <laughs> it's getting awkward now, isn't it? It is a bit. A bit awkward. Um, how are you, darling? I'm really good. Did you, you have a nice weekend? Yes, I did. Thank you. You I, I could see on that face there. You're thinking, what, what did, did I, I do? No, I did something this weekend. I did. So I was in. I was here Saturday. Yeah. And then uh, I went with uh, Lola and Leah and Amelia, and we did our escape. Room. Did you know that I saw Lola on Saturday? Yeah, she said. We bumped into each other yes. um, when we were taking Willow down to the, the playground. Yeah. So they were having a little uh, little go on the slide she was together. She saying to me how cute she was. Oh bless her. Really How's this Lola? Cute. 
She's, she's very confident, isn't she? She is very confident. Very yeah. confident and really but well spoken. Um, mm. Yeah, it's been hot as well, hasn't it? Really, yes. really hot. Yeah, very hot. Um, I, w I joined our gorgeous Emma. Yeah, you know, the one and only Emma Perry. Oh. Emma oh. Perry. Hello. There she is. Um, yesterday, because we went to say hello to Danny and Claire. Remember Danny and Claire? Yeah. Of course you do. It was, uh, it was our lovely Claire's 30th birthday yesterday. So if you're watching, happy birthday. And thank you so much for having me. It was a really lovely day. Hot, hot, hot. Very hot. Very, very hot. Beautiful spread put on by Emma's mum. Yeah. Nice. Lovely spread. You know, had some, oh. um, we had some salad, some rice salad, oh, you know, nice. pork pies. Ooh. Yeah, lovely. That's everything. Picky mm. food, that's like my dream yeah. come true, that. In the sunshine. Yeah, lovely. amazing. Um, hello, Rosalind, how are you? I full named you this morning. <laughs> there she is. You're not in trouble, don't worry. How's your weekend been? I know you were here, I saw you. All weekend you were here. Really? Oh, okay. So that, yeah, you have literally been here. Up. Um, I saw you on Saturday because I did the Late Show Saturday. The first thing I did on, um, on the Late Show was say, good morning, everybody. I'm like, oh, no, it's not morning. I don't think I've ever worked with you on a Late Show. I, I don't <gasps> do them often. Yeah. I'm, I'm, to be honest, it's probably because I don't get asked to do them very often because it's... <laughs> Because it is quite well known that I, I'm very, I'm not a night owl at all. I, I don't do well yeah. late at night. I, 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 you know, I was quite surprised you didn't see me. A, because by the time I got home, you know, get into, into comfy, something I was talking about as well on Saturday. Um, you know, it's almost 11 o'clock and that's like 4 a.m. for me. It's really late. So, yeah, but I need to do some more. I do need yeah. to do some more. Um, we are being spoilt today as well. We are being spoilt because we have got the lovely Paul Demiers. Um, there Yay. he is. Are you all right, Paul? You're in a particularly good mood today, which I like. Not that you're not normally. <laughs> just <saying. laughs> he, he makes it very well known when he's not in a good mood. Let's just put it that way. I'll just say I'm grumpy today. I'm grumpy. And like, hey, listen, we all know where we stand then. Yeah. Yeah. You're not grumpy. He's really not grumpy at all. Not grumpy at all. I am going to insist that. Um, does it, what, what our, our viewers think you're grumpy. No, you're not grumpy. You're definitely, <laughs> definitely not. Um, don't forget as well, I always call her our little ray of sunshine. Um, there would be no jewellery maker without this lovely lady. It's Amelia. Oh. 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 <laughs> there she is. <laughs> Bursting into the studios. Yay! She's like a coiled spring, is our Amelia. If you Aww. want to see energy pint sized, then just look at Amelia, because literally, I wish I could bottle her energy. Absolutely. Um, and I'd have, yeah. I'd have a shot of it every Definitely. morning, every oh, single yes. morning. Especially when we're doing DVDs. Yes, because yeah. Claire and I, mm -hmm. I apologise if, if I start looking a little bit sleepy. Um, it's because we were filming a DVD this morning. All of we us were, were up bright and early. We were. What time did the alarm go off? My first one went off at uh, 3.50. Oh. Wow. 3.50. <laughs> and then I snoozed it till, I think, 5 past 4. Wow. Mine wasn't that early. Wasn't it? No. Oh. Not that early at all. What time did you get up, Em? What time did you get up? Uh, half four. Half four. Yeah, I was the same. About half past four. About half past four. Oh, three. That's just mm. like even. That's painful. That is. It's, yeah, that is um, the middle of the night. Should we get cracking? Yeah. Should we get cracking? So <laughs> Ross is like, Ellie, you're just going to chat all morning. <laughs> I could. I could if that's what you want me to do. Um, no, you want, of course, beautiful, beautiful jewellery components, don't you? Right. Let's get starting with. Um, I've not seen these before. Um, they are huge. Um, are we meant to have the jump rings with it? Yes, yes, jump rings and all. Look at these, Claire McDonald. Oh, oh, I haven't seen those before. Neither have I. Um, I like that we're doing all these. Um, they're sizable, aren't they? They're Gosh, fabulous. They are. Yeah. I'm also thinking things like you know, um, what do you call it? Like your pocket watches and things mm. like that. That'd be really nice yeah. on the chain for your pocket watches. Yeah. Ninety-five pence. These are silver plated. These are silver plated. 
they're huge, just to get an idea of perspective, if I pop my hands behind, look, 35 millimetres um, in their size, you get the jump rings as well, how many jump rings are we actually getting there, let me count, two, four, six, I've got seven here, is that right? Is that seven? Even so, 95p. Doesn't matter whether it's six or whether it's eight, really. At 95 pence, you get three of these. You get three of these huge tea bars. Um, okay, there's a wake up call for us all, isn't mm. it? You know? Low quantity, though, Ross is saying, so you're going to need to be quick. Um, you're going to need to be on the, on the web. You're going to need to be checking out. If you're with me on the phone lines, you're going to need to be dialing quite swiftly. I've still got quantity, but um, I think it's because it's Monday morning and, you know, every, everybody, we, we like to ease ourselves into a Monday morning, don't we? Yeah, yeah. No easing today, sorry. Not allowed. No easing. Um, because the deals are going to be coming at you thick and fast. Good morning, Deirdre. Hello, Elaine. Hello, Constance. Hello, Marion, who's bought six. Savvy buying, that is, Marion. Um, I would be doing exactly the same. We've never seen them before. No, because we always talk, don't we, about if you'd separated out the toggle class when yeah. you, do the, uh, you do your cuffling. So yeah. that's, that's perfect, isn't it? Uh, I would be yeah, multi-buying with those, definitely. Yeah. What could we use them with? Cause, well, I was just thinking you could use it as a base, couldn't you? I don't know. I'm seeing like a little swing or something. Oh. You know, like a wire work swing. <laughs> I, wa I, I wasn't seeing that, but okay. Oh, yeah. oh okay. Like, because like you don't often, you'd have to make it yourself, wouldn't you? Whereas that's really structural with a, with a, an attached bale, so you could have like a little a little swing on it. Okay. <laughs> with a tiny polymer clay person. Oh, okay. Sort of like going back to our youth when you used to have those rope tree swings. Yes, yeah, so if you've got some chain, you'd yeah, like you've got some across. chain coming down. Okay. <laughs> Love that. <laughs> Love that idea. I have to say, Claire, yeah. that was not what I was expecting you to say. But there we go. Wonderful. That's why I was going to say easy. No, no, well, listen, yeah. Oh, three. Three fifty. Yeah. Ouch. Ouch. Yeah. Ouch. Um, okie dokie. Let's start with some gorgeous gemstones, shall we? Faceted rounds. Um, I love Agate. I think it's one of those gemstones that really brings you. Uh, of course, rarity, but it gives you variation as well, doesn't it? Because you get wonderful tones, um, and today is all about the ombre. Love it. Ombre is a new, it's not a new word, but it's a word that's very current, isn't it now? Ombre. Ombre. Ombre, yeah. You're seeing it everywhere, aren't you? Mm. Even at the hair salon. Yes. People actually have ombre hair. What is ombre? It's like going dark to light or light to dark. It's like a fading. It's a fading. So a perfect strand, actually, for that. Yeah, lots of people. My, um, Emma was talking about it to me, actually, the other day. She was saying she fancies her hair in an ombre. Mm. So it's going a like nice a dark look, auburn to a blonde at the Ooh, end of nice, the tip. So yeah. Yeah, I was like, yeah, do it. That's going to be fabulous, especially with her curly locks. Um, £3.95. Wow. Did you say it's very 90s? Is it? Having, having blonde tips on your hair is 90s. Well, the 90s fashion is back, is back in, Paul, don't you know? You know, haven't you seen all, like, the MC Hammer pants everywhere? You know, the MC Hammer trousers and everything, they're all yeah, back in fashion. Yeah, it's like lower, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the big, big jackets, the, like, mm. puffy jackets. Next thing you'll see Paisley, guaranteed. Paisley's going to be back in. Not stopping here, though, jewellery makers. Let's start this week as we mean to go on. Um, there we go. See what I mean? That ombre colour, so you can very easily do that. Um, cheeky little price reduction from our Roz. Thanks, Roz. Pleasure, she says. She loves you guys. She's been here all weekend. She doesn't need any rest. Does our Roz doesn't need any rest at all, um, and she gives you deals like this. That's why we love you. Well, it's true. Um, lots of web bidders again, just saying yes, please. I'll have some of those because they're stash essentials, aren't they? Yeah, they are. Very, very useful. You could have uh, a nice beady bead, couldn't you? With those? really lovely beady bead, yeah. and I'm also just thinking about what we've just filmed, Claire. Yes. Because I'm a, yeah. I would say what it is. I don't want to spoil the surprise, but let's just say it's a DVD where you could use. <laughs> Fairly obvious, but okay. But you could use these as an alternative to a bead. Yes, yeah, yes, you could along the outside. Yeah, yeah, 
That'd be good. I know yeah. it sounds very yeah. vague, jewelry makers. That's I know you're watching right now saying, what on earth are you talking about? We filmed a DVD this morning that will be launched in the near future. If you get these, it's a great alternative, an amazing alternative, mm. actually. Um, Multi-buying going on, well done. £2.95 for a genuine gemstone. I mean, that's the reality. Low quantity opportunity, the Ros is saying, so be careful if you're looking at something and you're thinking, yeah, I need those. Um, yeah, you need to you need to make sure that they are they are guaranteed to you and you're committing to them straight away. I've got loads of deals to bring you. I've got gorgeous pearls. How amazing would these be alongside pearls? I'm just thinking about a really lovely cappuccino. Um, like cappuccino kind of inspiration, mm. those gorgeous colours. Um, these look fabulous alongside. Here we go. Just again, give you some sneaky peeks. Some Larimar. Oh, yeah. that's nice. I like that. It's a nice combination, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. Um, what about some chocolate? pearls now these yeah they're lovely aren't they wow. do you know very low quantity i launched these with uh, with mark smith and they flew out the door they're incredible never seen a pearl of that shape before mm. they're almost like little tadpole shapes aren't they um, in fact, we do these now. Um, it is a continuous length also. Can I just say it's 360 degrees. It's a necklace in its own right. You don't need to do anything to it. That's amazing. Yeah. Love it. And we, uh, the reason why well, I can remember bringing them and Mark was like, they are my strand of the day. Mm -hmm. when, when he saw these, he was like super duper excited um, because they've got, they're all completely different. You've almost got that nucleated bead circle and then it's like it's like a shooting shooting star tail do you see where i'm coming yeah, from yeah. um sort of coming from um each of um each of these pearls they are cultured pearls these aren't a, a synthetic uh, gemstone and to be honest it would be very difficult to make these in a synthetic bead glass plastic because they are so varied effectively. Um, with all of those lovely textures, you get a really heightened sense of iridescence across there as well. Dark, intense body color as well. I mean, look at this. Let's just, let's just focus on a couple of them. Look at these ones here. They're beautiful, aren't they? I've never seen anything like that strand. No, it's I don't really, think I've ever yeah. bought. Never. 180 in about two minutes was yeah when these were last brought to air i remember it clearly i was lucky enough to uh lucky enough to bring them to you um and and it's memorable because like i said we haven't had anything quite like them before because you're still getting all the iridescence aren't yeah. you as well only five of these left grab them whilst you can and you you could you know deconstruct it if you wanted to but effectively it's a piece of jewelry in its own right mm. um well done to you cornwall well done to you dawn uh, congratulations to claire in bristol very 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 limited opportunity i've got people with it in their baskets as well it's not guaranteed to you until you actually make that confirmation I mean, literally, just wrapping it around, doubling it over if you wanted to, because you can make two, effectively, 360 uh, necklaces here, couldn't you? Use it around the wrist as well. Perfect mm. for your holidays. Absolutely perfect. Um, is it the time already? It's because I was gassing so much at the beginning of the show, isn't it? It's time for your alarm clock deal. Okie dokie, who wants some essentials? I um, have to say, you know I've been making a few pieces of jewellery just lately and, and I really need to stock up on essentials because I get caught up in, of course, the excitement of gemstones and new launches, etc. But it's so easy to forget that you need things like your jump rings, your head pins, um, your elastics, that's what I've run out of, your bolt ring clasps, you know, things like that. It's so easy to forget that they are essentials and without them you can't make your jewellery. Um, so, well, perfect, perfect then, your alarm clock deal for you. Now expect a frenzy on the phone lines just to give you a little bit of a heads up expect um, it to be it to be quite busy but you know that it is a free phone telephone number you know that you are calling um, a UK based contact center as well um, and honestly the, 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 the time that you're investing it's worth because the savings of your alarm clock deal is absolutely huge now um, I have only got sadly a limited quantity of these not nearly enough um, as many as I'd like um, because as I said they are essentials we need our bolt ring clasps not very often do we actually get the five millimeter size which i love because if you think about it they're going to work so beautifully with the four mil gemstones they're going to work with your stacker style bracelets which i know claire you did a workshop of the other day didn't you yes this week
week. It's coming up this week. Is it week? this week? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wednesday. Exciting. Yeah. Um, so perfect for that. Perfect with, you know, your micro faceted gemstones as well. But at the same time, is, is more than substantial enough to actually use with your 8 mil. Oh, she's Ross. Literally. Where did that come from? No, no warning for that at all. No warning for that 3.95 price tag, and it's not what it says on my sheet. My sheet says more than that. I'm not criticising. Who am I? I am but a minion. I do as I am told. <laughs> I am your puppet. 3.95, Ross says today. Do you like that? Do you like the fact that I'm your puppet? <laughs> I do as I'm told. Some of the time. <laughs> Some of the time. Yeah, stock up your stash while you get the chance. This is gold plated sterling silver at 395, Claire. I mean, you know. We're not talking about base metals here. No, it's your precious metal, isn't it? Yeah, precious and you use metal. them all the time. Yeah, we get all ten the of time. Them. Yeah. I mean, can we just take a moment not to be complacent for a second? Can we take a moment? You know, we used to bring you these in packs of threes and they'd be a higher price tag than that. Um, so we're actually bettering ourselves and we've always been amazingly competitive. We truly have. But be, to be able to bring them to you, at, what's that working out? At pennies each is just, just crazy. I only had a limited quantity. Literally, um, masses of them actually sold instantaneously. Um, I would be multi-buying on this as well. I have to say, I'm a fan of a five mil bolt ring. Yes, yeah, it is nice, isn't it? It is a nice size. It's a strange Doesn't sentence, like... <laughs> but it's what I mean. <laughs> you stand by it. Outside of the jewelry maker family, that would sound weird, wouldn't it? Yeah. You know. But nothing sounds weird in here. That's, that's <laughs> I thought right. you were going to say nothing, nothing sounds, sounds weird, weird coming from here. But that's a good, a good size, though, isn't it? If you wanted to add in your charms to um, existing... You know, like um, oh. stretchy bracelets or things like that. It would fit in quite nicely there. Perfect. And I was in that charm, one of the charm shops from mm. yes, yes, the other day before was it? Um, anyway, um, and yes, it is. They they do tend to use the five mil. Size. Yeah, so it's a nice, um, discreet size, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's discreet. Mm. It's not going to hinder from the, you know, the attraction, which is in particular the charm, or the, the actual pendant, if you like, or the actual design of the bracelet itself. Three ninety five for you only. Um, already way over 50% of the stock has actually gone. Um, absolutely. Oh, I've just seen it alongside your deal of the day. Oh, is perfect. That, is that the deal of the day? Is that is the that, deal of the day? Cause that, yeah, I was just looking at Do that. That would be it? perfect size. Here it is. Perfect with the deal of the day. And how many bracelets, how many necklaces are you going to create? Oh, that's nice. Isn't it beautiful? Mm. Micro faceted lemon quartz and gorgeous garnet. I love that combination. It's that really delicate, mm. sort of golden colour. It's absolutely stunning. Yeah, that's coming your way at 11 a.m. this morning. Um, get your bolt ring class whilst you can. And like I said, if you want to get 10 of them, you fill your boots. No problem with you doing that at all. Um, stock up your stash. Right, should we bring you the larger size? So that's what, you know, we bring you variation as well here at Jewelry Maker. Oh, I'm looking at the, uh, I, was just looking, I was just looking at that lovely little turtle dove. Isn't that pretty? Um, okay, okay, right, moving on to, I get distracted very easily. Ooh, ooh, look at the amber. Ooh, um, pretty things. Okay, so, here we go. So we'll give you that variation of the smaller sizes, um, but also the larger sizes. These are your eight millimeter. Okay, hang on a minute. We've jumped up three mil per bolt ring clasp, and we've only, only gone up by a pound. Makes no sense at all. You know, that's an, uh, just an extra 10 pence per clasp. And you know, these are, real engineering because you've got to think about the internal mechanisms of this which will be precious metal as well precious metal also um, there's a spring in there also that gives you that how do i say it you know the actual pullback um ability uh, 4.95 only and the things are beauty aren't they i mean the class should be beautiful too yeah beautiful and so you need to know like it's aesthetics doesn't it and, and how 
practical it is and, and secure. Yeah. Because that, that's everything that sort of Peace holds of it together. Yeah. Absolutely. Well, it's the main function, yeah. isn't it, really? Yeah. The main function is to, you don't want to have a weaker clasp or something that's not made well because then effectively, like I said, one, you know, one pull and it might be gone. Mm. Um, amazing limited quantity. What should we talk about this morning, jewelry makers? Tell me what you've been up to this weekend because it's the start of the heat wave, it's the start of the summer. Um, so what were you up to? Is anyone going on? Oh, is anyone going on a holiday next week? Ross says, me. I don't think you deserve it, to be honest. <laughs> Do you have... Um, mm. Where's Ross Sorry. going? I don't think she's wor worked enough hours no. lately. No, I don't think so. You deserve it. Of course you do. You've just got back from your holly bobs, haven't you? Oh, that was ages ago. Not that really. doesn't count anymore. It was no. this month. Was it? Yeah. <laughs> Not really. It. it was you went. You went like a couple of weeks before me. Uh, well, it doesn't feel like it now. That doesn't Do you count. You need another though. holiday. Yes, okay, please. Um, <laughs> let's. Yeah. Okay. Where, where would you like to go? Um, I'll go anywhere. I don't mind. Somewhere nice and warm. But it's going to be nice and warm here. Exactly. Isn't it? Yeah. Um, I'm off to I'm off to Shropshire this weekend with my Ooh, family. Oh, lovely. Yeah, I'm really excited about it. Actually, I think it's going to be really lovely. We're doing a bit of glamping, so that's going to be fun. Oh, it's going to be lots Have of fun. Have you got a hot tub it? there? Yes. <gasps> We've got like a log cabin oh, amazing. with a hot tub. How cool is that? I know it's not really camping, is it? You can't really call it camping. Not so much. Um, but yeah, get in touch. Okay, log cabin isn't camping. I get it. I get it. But you know, it's kind of outdoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's in a wooded area. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not pitching the tent, though. I must admit. Um, okay. Should we do the Larimar? See, you've got the clasp straight away. Mm. All you need to do is add a bit of beading th uh, thread. Thread. F <laughs> it's all you need to do. And a crimp. And you're done. I've given you all the components that you need to make a very, very high-end piece of jewellery. So I did pull my teeth in properly this morning. <laughs> right. I don't actually have dentures, but I just sometimes talk like I do. <laughs> poorly fitted ones um, this is a one locational gemstone all the way from the Dominican Republic oh and it is extremely rare it forms within um, sort of voids that are underneath the earth's surface um, which have been created by volcanic activity there is no way of actually predicting how much Larimar there is left um, on this planet just because of course if you imagine um, lava would travel very erratically um, uh, uh, in different directions so you can't predict the depth etc um, so this is a gemstone that we're seeing less and less and less it's increasing in its price tag if you were lucky enough to uh, or have been lucky enough to travel to the Caribbean or along cruise liners you certainly have seen the price of Larimar and we've had countless messages through um, throughout the years of the prices that this gemstone fetches elsewhere outside of the JM family. 695 wow. Roz. Goodness me. I wasn't expecting that at all. Um, Roz's words, I want it gone. <gasps> really? Are you serious? You want about yes, but now I'm okay. Now I'm just gonna pick you up on that one. Roz has just said, okay, because I want them to buy more. It's not a given. It's not a given, Larimar. It's not like a gemstone, which, you know, is readily available. It's from one location on this entire planet. I reckon we probably have got, I reckon, what do you reckon, two or three strands within our entire vault of this gemstone? Less than that now, Ross says. 6 95 Have you ever even seen Larimar at a single-figure price tag? It's all gone. She says, it's all gone. Um, that would look lovely with those chocolate pills. Mm. Um, should we do some gorgeous iolite? That's pretty. Mm. Nice shape, isn't it, as well? Yeah, the work's done for you, so just literally restrand this, and I think, look how lovely that would be as a neckline piece. Um, iolite is completely natural. It's a really beautiful denim blue colour. Um, these are uh, squares. Do you know, it's so funny, ever since... Um, I, I, who was it that said to me? Who was it that said to me? I hate the use of the word plain. Who just said that, Ros? Yeah, it's not a good word to use, is it? Hmm. 
Yeah, just ignore that. Just ignore that. These are graduated squares. Um, it's meaning they're not faceted, so I understand why it's included, but um, it kind of means that they're maybe not, not spectacular, which they actually are. They really are. Um, so the less facets that gemstones actually have, really the higher quality it has to be because effectively you're going to see more internal inclusions um, without facets. But look at that intensity of colour. Wow. I mean, um, is this how you're feeling today, Roz? Um, and you know, sometimes I like to jump on my soapbox and have a little bit of a rant. <laughs> we are bringing you here at Jewellery Maker a much broader selection of gemstones, aren't we now? And a much broader selection of gemstone quality too. Mm. So we are bringing you, I mean, prime example, the Australian diamonds that we've got coming up, a higher quality, but we are also bringing you um, more affordable quality too. Um, so please, I saw, I saw I, 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 just because I can see, I've seen comments where people are saying that we're getting very, very expensive. We're giving you variation and we're doing it deliberately. We're doing it deliberately so that we can actually, um, and I'm not criticizing as well. I know that everybody is, it's an observation. Yes, we are bringing you higher priced items, but we aren't, we, you can't say that we can't, we're not bringing you affordable as well. Yeah, I think it's a bit of both, isn't it? Um, Absolutely. For lots of I mean, taste. I haven't brought a single gemstone strand over over ten pounds yet. Oh, I have. Sorry, the pearls, the pearls, and they were only nineteen ninety five. Um, so, yeah, just I just wanted to say because I think there's a real. I think that was a bit unfair because I think we've got a real selection, mm. a real selection right now. If I was, to, if we were to walk around the actual vault, um, I would be able to bring you offerings like this. And don't forget, Iolite is a precious precious gemstone which is very seldom seen is very very rarely seen on the mainstream market and yet we're still bringing it to you at 595 um, I just wanted to give our team some credit there because I just think you know they're doing amazing things um, well done to you Helen Glamorgan Francis Anne Tatiana Suze James well done lots of multi buying hi again uh, good morning two of my favorite JM people I did just assume you kind of meant me and Claire <laughs> Were you talking about me and Claire or were you talking about, you know, Roz and Paul? Emma and Amelia? It's very true, actually. We shouldn't have made that assumption, no. should we? No. Hi, Gainer, though. Hiya. Yeah. Yeah, Good you're morning. one of our favourite people. Um, hi, Suze. I love you, Alice. So <laughs> it is glamping, isn't it? <laughs> uh -huh. Technically speaking, there is an a plug socket, so it's not really, is it? There is, or there isn't. There is a plug socket. Yeah, yeah. Hey, listen. And, and by the <laughs> hang on, hang on. Is there a telly in there? I don't know. <laughs> I've got no idea. I wouldn't imagine so. I wouldn't imagine. Um, it, I'm really looking for. Okay, so what do I call it then? I'm going log cabining. <laughs> <laughs> sounds it sounds a bit strange, that doesn't it? What yeah. do I call it? Uh, hmm. <laughs> Would you prefer it if I pitched up a tent? So I'll have all my family in the log cabins and I'll be in the tent. <laughs> Shall I do that? <laughs> I'm not taking hair straighteners. Don't be silly. For a weekend? No. It's going to be no straighteners, no makeup for the whole weekend. Why do you think I'm so looking forward to it? Yeah. <laughs> In the woods, <laughs> I'm gonna terrify people. <laughs> Terrifying! Don't go near Shropshire. <laughs> there's this, there's this weird being there in the woods. <laughs> yeah, if you see anything in the in the newspaper anytime soon, don't worry, it's just me. It's fine. I just don't normally venture out without any makeup on. <laughs> it's not the puffer. They're like, oh my god, what is that? <laughs> It's a bit like Bigfoot, only blonde. <laughs> okay, up next, you go to start by. <laughs> amazing chatoyancy who loves a mirage almost in a gemstone it's not a mirage you can believe it um, but an amazing optical effect where light is almost tricked to perform that's what tiger's eye actually does um, oh, look at these now I think that these beautiful, beautiful sizes, two mil, three mil, the delicate sizes, they're, they're, they're kind of, 
we almost think, oh gosh, they're tiny, couldn't do a great deal with those. Or some of us might, I, should, I shouldn't make that assumption. But actually, those smaller sizes really, really do um, add amazing detail, don't they, Claire? Yeah, definitely. And, and, and you know, the fact that, that with that size, you can layer up, can't you, if you wanted yeah. to. So use them on their own. So like little stacker bracelets on their own. Or well, you mentioned your wire beady work. beads. Yeah, yeah. Beady beads. Beading, you know, uh, cabochons, you know, sort of like bezel setting them with those. In amongst, lots and lots of uses. In amongst your shibori or your soutache. Yeah, yeah. Um, in amongst your sort of backing foundation as well, sewing around yeah, your cabochons. Yeah, macrame, things like macrame, that. Macrame, yeah. perfect. Humahino. Look at those colours. Isn't it beautiful? Tiger's eye, like I said, um, it, it, this is red tiger's eye, so it has actually been dyed that gorgeous colour. And I'll be the first to admit that I was proved massively wrong. The first time that we actually saw red tiger's eye, blue tiger's eye, pink tiger's eye, I was like, really, why are we dyeing a gemstone that's actually got uh, that, um, um, that amazing colour already, um, but also actually produces that chatoyancy? Surely it's going to almost um, hide it, but it really doesn't. It almost intensifies yeah, it. it. it so I'll be the it, first it, yeah. to admit that I was proved wrong in that. Uh, by that 10 carats you're getting here jewelry maker yeah so incredibly versatile these rounds and and because i've been making more jewelry just lately um you know i've made a conscious effort to do to, to try and spend a couple of hours maybe um every other night if you like just making a few bits um that, 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 that just for enjoyment as well as much as for the charity itself that i'm going to be donating to but um it is it's really lovely, and it's these kind of sizes that I need. You use, lo you, you, do you find the same? I'm using yeah. loads of rounds. And yes, definitely, definitely loads of rounds, and um, you know, like little bits of movement. So if you do like bubble clusters on yeah. lots of head pins with with gemstones that are that size, that works really nicely. And it's not overpowering, is it? No. It's still like little delicate details. Really love it. It's the kind of things that I have to stock up my stash. I bought a few the other day, um, but yeah, I'm, I was looking on the website, and there's actually very few plain rounds on there mm. but not not as much as i'd like anyway um so stay tuned today because there's going to be loads featured throughout the course of the morning 295 only hiya tracy hello norma tatiana Kyoto. hello to mandy as well um gloucestershire congratulations to you um perfect for your ombre because you could actually go from the bright vibrant kind of red um, to that sort of darker, more burgundy, perfect for that. If you want to do, if you can't be bothered, then you don't need to. Hiya, Tink. Make sure you keep that toe covered, Elle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want to scare people, lol. Love you, really. It's okay. It's Hey, Tink, it's... Have you not heard the toe story, Paul? Okay, yeah. It's quite well known that my toe is quite large. I don't fall over very often, let's just put it that way. It's like a sucker. <laughs> No, no, I've got more than one toe. <laughs> My big toe is like a sucker. I can climb walls, really. I didn't notice that today when I was looking at the... I'll show you at in your, the break. At your feet. That... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I won't do that, Tink. People don't need to see that kind of thing. I don't even do that to my family. When... Um, I wear my flip-flops on the opposite <laughs> feet. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, the bit where your four toes should be, no, that's where my big toe goes. <laughs> I walk around in circles quite a lot. <laughs> uh, I haven't got abnormal toes, They're just, they, are, they are balanced, they're both just rather large. I won't think, I won't do that. When Willow was born, do you know the first thing that, that, that my husband said to me? It wasn't, well done darling, oh she's beautiful, you're amazing. <laughs> she's like, she's got your toe! That was the first thing he said to me. The first thing, it's like, it's, it's a perfect toe. Perfect, perfect. I wouldn't do that, Tink. Although I am wearing flip-flops today. Um, okay, moving on to... Uh, right, again, see, we need to stock up our stash. Um, this is the perfect show. I should be shopping right now, Roz. This is everything that I need. I, I need my two, my three, my four mils. In fact, I just need rounds generally. That's what I actually need. Um, gorgeous sky blue appetite. One of the rarest colours on this planet. You know I say that. I say that quite frequently. And it's absolutely perfect for the summertime, isn't it? Um, would look lovely. I don't know if you're feeling this as well, Claire. But don't you think alongside the yeah. gate? Yeah. Yeah. And with the, uh, with the Larimar as well. Oh! Nice. Now, now then. Mmm. Look at that as a kit. If you really want to go all out, 
Oh, can I do this without dropping them? Hang on. Ha, ha. No, oh. is the answer. No, I absolutely can't. But look. Oh, I like that, yeah. If you really want to go all out for a perfect kit, imagine that as a combination. How fabulous. How beautiful as a combination. Yeah, and uh, we've brought you the Laramar. We've brought you the Agates if you've just tuned in. Maybe you're just back from doing the school run. Um, or you've just got yourself into your workplace and you're watching us on the old lowdown. That's fine too. Four ninety-five only. Um, now I always reference the, the the average carrot weight. Do you watch us on the low down, Roz? When you're at work, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Don't tell mind because you're getting trouble. You're getting trouble. Sometimes she turns over. She says, <laughs> yesterday, "Yesterday, oh, who did you have yesterday?" Now, Becky, when really, when really you were watching the football, you mean? Yeah, whatever. We believe you. It was, um, I, do you know what, it, yeah, I've seen videos, horrifying videos, I have to say, in, in our local town. Awful videos. Really? Terrible. You know, just, you know, if it, it's, it's, it's all lovely and everything, but, you know, and it's, you're having a drink, a nice drink, sunshine and everything, but stay orderly, people. Come on. People oh. climbing on buses and stuff. Really? Honestly. <gasps> Horrendous. <laughs> You know, that poor bus driver and the people on the bus. Oh, on top no. of the buses in our local town. Like, oh, dear. At your age. Seriously. Wonderful that England won, by the way. But, you know. Anyway, rant over. <laughs> I'm just saying, I'm just saying, you know. It's, it, can, it can be enjoyed responsibly, can't it? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Paul say that sound really old. Well, maybe. <laughs> Don't care. Just saying, somebody could have got hurt. Oh, couldn't they? They could have fallen off the bus. And um, five of these are left. Five of them are left. I'm sure it probably wasn't just in our hometown as well. I'm sure it happens for a few places. Um, Okie dokie. Um, we've still got loads to bring you today. Four ninety-five only. It's pointless me saying I'm going to be able to get. Some, I'm getting some of those because I'm not. They're going to sell out. Um, how about some amazing keshis? <gasps> um, I don't know why, but they've been very elusive just lately. Our keshi pearls. Mm. Um, but they, then they are one of your most popular pearls. Um, we, we're really embracing, not just us here at Jewelry Maker, I think collectively uh, in the industry, we're really embracing pearls for their really uh, sort of organic um, shapes and textures that you get. Yes, these are genuine and they are natural pearls. They just tessellate beautifully. You can get a variation of shapes, as you can notice, there are some lovely pear drops there. You've got some which are, you know, really unique. Um, just like this one here, it's almost curved, can you see? Um, Akeshi Pearl usually are very expensive. 11.95 doesn't reflect that, but then that's why you shop with us here at Jewelry Maker. We've squeezed it under £10 for you this morning and this morning only. There will be deals today that will not be repeated, and I'll tell you why they won't. Probably because they'll sell out then and there, uh, then and there. Um, but reality is, um, our, the reality is, our Ross, she's a law unto herself. So she does, she does, she does things that she's really not supposed to. And you know, you're not, you don't even hesitate about it, do you? No, not at all. What would you do with these, Claire? Because I always just think restranding. I would do flowers with between. them because the, the way they're drilled and the shape of them, so they're lovely petals, either with um, your deal of the day, because you could do daisies, couldn't you? Lovely with the deal of the day. Yeah. So that would be nice. So We've got 500 say, of these as well. Wow. Oh, they look beautiful together. Yeah, so you could do like your daisy or like with the, the garnet centre. But they're really nice on, um, you know, with your tiara twists on, on mm -hmm. hair combs and hair bridal jewellery, things like Hair that. Hair vines. Mm. Um, yeah, a, a, an acquaintance of, of, of mine, uh, my husband's actually got married yesterday and I was looking at her um, her pictures and she, she's, she's a really beautiful girl anyway. Um, and she wore a very simple dress and had an amazing hair vine um, wow. in amongst her dark hair. It looked absolutely yeah. incredible. Really beautiful. Yeah, it's this kind of, th kind of thing. I don't know, she might have made it herself. This kind of collection, I agree, Claire, that would just look absolutely perfect with that. Um, equally, a Alongside, 
the sterling silver wire that we've got coming up in one of your kits alongside the boomy sapphire that mm. we've got coming up a little bit later on as well um, you know pearls lend themselves to every other gemstone out there because of you know, the, well monochrome of course um, but they just they just work don't they they just yeah, they go. do with like you say with everything with the yeah. Laramar, um you know you've got um with the i think you've got you've got kunzite nuggets as well the the rounds that you've got the appetite there's loads of things they'd work with um hello to you julie susie what's it i agree with you well though me and my hubby were wild with excitement and actually had a pint between us um on the afternoon rebels <laughs> yeah see thank you thank you i just think it's unnecessary um, we've been feeling rebellious today, but I won't be jumping on any any buses or anything like that. Um, morning, guys. I'm working from home this morning, uh, but watching, feeling a bit naughty. <laughs> <laughs> Paul is picturing me uh, jumping on a bus. It would never happen. It would never. No, I'm not at the festival. I'm I'm here at Jewelry Maker. Are you trying to corrupt me, Paul? <laughs> Just try to corrupt me. Just see me at the festival. <laughs> That's like last year, isn't it? Like last year, yeah. we were. We, I think. I think they're still getting over Claire and I last year and Fleur. Yeah. Hmm. A little bit, a little bit tipsy last year at the festival. Just a little bit. Yeah. They didn't beg us, or they didn't didn't beg me to go this year. Did they not? <laughs> Once they planned it, you know, the whole of the media for, planned it so that I wasn't able to go. <laughs> no, it wasn't that bad, honestly, it wasn't that bad. Um, yeah. <laughs> 9.95 only. Um, absolutely beautiful. Right, would you like another amazing star mine? Good, because it's up next. Um, I actually saw a dove yesterday. Yeah. Oh, and they are beautifully majestic, aren't they? I haven't seen these. Have you not? No. Really gorgeous, gorgeous Aww. charms. And you get both of them. Look at that. In flight. Beautiful gold-plated sterling silver. Look at that. Ah. I like that. And then, just here, and I will pick it up in a second, you've actually got the heart. How amazing. So I'm just going to make a suggestion, folks, just because I know it's big at the moment. You know, like um, couples jewellery, yeah, um, or sort of partner or friendship jewellery, not necessarily, I'm not necessarily mm. talking about husband and wife. Um, you know, it can be, uh, it can be girlfriends, it can be, um, it can be mother and daughter, it can be father and daughter, whichever. You know, how lovely to actually create two pieces of jewellery that you can, you can both wear and it's a sign of kind of unity. I think it's everywhere at the moment. I think this is a really lovely idea. Um, so one would wear the heart, one would wear actually um, the dove itself. Or you can just treat yourself and put it all into, into one design. Again, this is the kind of thing that I need, Roz. I need to be, I need to be buying some of these. Wow. 6.95 for two <clears throat> charms. Two charms. That goes perfectly, doesn't it, with the, the bolt ring class that you had? Uh, yes. With the, oh, sorry. Let me just turn him over. I don't like the fact that he's on his, on, on his back. There we go. Let me just pick that one up. There's that gorgeous heart. So again, oh, I was... Oh, I like these. 925 stamp just here. I was in that charm shop only a few days ago. And hey, beautiful jewellery. Really, really, really beautiful jewellery in there. Don't think I'm saying anything otherwise. But it's expensive. It's expensive in comparison. I, I think I might shop today. Yeah, me too. I feel a shopping spree. Mm. Ross, please, can you make sure there's enough of these? Yeah, you can make me shop. Let me shop. Yeah, I'm a, I'm allowed to shop when I'm making jewellery. That's my that's my little mantra. Apparently, there's only forty one of these, Claire. Oh gosh. Apparently, only forty one. I want them as well. Do you? Yeah, I'd be popping them in in, in a simple bracelet or maybe a jewel bracelet, mm. making make that couple's piece. That's my my uh, my idea anyway. If you want to do the same, you filly boots. Uh, Dawn and Tatiana, Ella, London. Yeah, I'd like some of these. Do you want some as well, Claire? I do, I, yeah. How many do you want then? Well, I was going to probably get 
three, maybe. Okay, yeah, three. I wouldn't mind three as well, Roz. Oh, no, that was my, that was my not too subtle hint to <clears throat> producer Roz to ring through to the call centre, but she didn't, she didn't take the bait. Maybe I should do what Alice and Harry does, and like, you know when she gets cramp and she has to go for a little walk? Yeah, she gets terrible yeah, cramp, she bless her. Yeah. She has to go, yeah, yeah, yeah. go out of the studio for a yeah. little, little at, at walk. At any point, you know, it's fine yeah. if you need to go and sort of rub your calf. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, that's where most people get cramp, isn't it? In mm. their calves. I get it in my feet. Yeah, I get it in my feet as well. <laughs> <laughs> I get it in my toe. <laughs> We've had the toe conversation yes. before. Yeah, because yeah. I've, I've got it as well. I what, like a, a big like toe? A big, big, big toe, uh, yeah. yeah. There we go then. Because that's, that's why my dad said I'd never get married. Because of your big yeah. toe? Because oh. it looked like the toffee penny from the... <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad it's not just me. So it's not just you. There we go. I'm so glad. Um, <laughs> these are very, very popular. I'm not surprised. Yeah, just saying, like, yeah, Claire, I'd like some of these as okay. well. Okay. Yeah. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna uh, pop yeah. out. Yeah. Maybe just get the app. Is that I can try yeah, to well, at the end of the show? Yeah, I have got the. Uh, um, yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Are you ready, folks? Sorry, Roz. Ross is looking at me just to say, for goodness sake. I literally cannot control you. I literally cannot control you, Al. It's, it, I tell you what it is, it's because I'm, I'm slightly delirious from tiredness. Oh, look, you get three different colours. <laughs> look, you get the three different colours of your gorgeous cubic zirconia. So I'm holding the colourless, obviously. Oh, your butterfly's in flight. You've got a really lovely marquise. Aren't they pretty? Um, you get a pack of three, eight by nine millimetres in their size. Let me pink up, pick up the pink. Um, yeah, so pretty. 925 sterling silver. How amazing would these be on just, you know, little Swarovski stretchy bracelets? A little girl would love them, wouldn't they? If I was to give this to Willow, she'd be like, ah, oh, flutter by. She, yeah, she, she does love butterflies, so I think that's a really nice idea. Stre little stretchy bracelets, 165 each. Let me just turn this over again so you can see the 925 stamp there on the reverse. Oh, see, now Roz wants to buy now. Claire is buying, yeah, she is. 495 for all three of them. Have you got quantity of these as well? 53 of them. Next time you do a little lineup of a show today, can you let me know? so I can arrange cover, just so I can sit at home and watch. <laughs> really, uh, yeah, we should have, we have a, direct, a direct line to our call centre team, really, shouldn't we? But then, you know, just a nod, just say, yeah, pop it in Elle's basket, pop it in Roz's basket. Um, Hi, Dawn, hello, Suze. Hi London, hello Julie, nice to be with you. Ah, oh, they're, they're little visions of summer, aren't they, butterflies? Yeah, they, apparently the call centre say to Ross, should we just leave your basket open? Yeah. Yeah, absolutely, because there's going to be more purchases. Um, if you pardon the pun, these are flying out the door. Sorry. They really, really are very, very popular, and lots of you are multi-buying. Aren't they pretty? So you've actually got, um, as you can see, a pink, a purple, and also a clear cubic zirconia colour. Ah, how lovely are these? Just on little head pins, they'd be nice, you know, just in, as, as sort of hair pins. Um, I'm just picturing, like, a Swarovski stretchy bracelet. I think they'd be really nice. Um, oh, good idea, Paul is saying. What about on a ring? Very nice. Very, very nice. Van Cleef and Arpels do like a really lovely, uh, a lovely sort of floral um, stroke flora and fauna inspired collection. Yeah, you could almost take a little look at those and recreate it. Um, Audrey, Derbyshire, Mid uh, West Midlands, you've got it. Lindsay, uh, pretty much everybody, in fact. Let me just double check before I say this. All bar one is multi-bought. All bar one is multi-bought on these. I, I, Claire, look. Oh, they're nice as well. So, so, so lovely. We just have to do a little tot up of how much I owe you at the end of the show. Well, I think I got us three each. Oh, good. I hope so. 
I hope so too. We've moved on to the next auction, so I can't, I can't, I can't check. Do Judith, well done. Audrey, well done. Congratulations. Right, would you? Ah, oh, they're just really cute. Like you might, I was saying, pop them on some Swarovski in a stretchy bracelet. I bet Lola would love that. Yeah, she would. Really I bet pretty. Would as well. Yeah, Willow definitely would. Um, follow the star. Ah, oh, I totally know what you mean. Uh, you get how many of them? One, two, five. Five of them. Here they are. Um, you'll understand the title when you see them. It's a really oh, beautiful nice, star cluster. It's a connector, so I'm holding on to one loop and then there's another just here. What a lovely lineup, Roz. Really beautiful little lineup. Love that. So we've had we've had hearts. We've had doves, we've had butterflies, now we're having stars. These are all very positive symbols, aren't they? Mm. Six ninety-five for five of these. Again, precious 925 sterling silver. You've got your cubic zirconia there with that wonderful um, sort of parve detail. Um, that's working out what, 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 uh, just over a pound each. 139 each. I'd be popping these with your deal of the day as well. Let me just grab it. Deal of the day. Do you see where I'm coming from? It's a nice size as well, isn't it? That's really pretty. Are these perfect components for your for your workshop that's coming up, Claire? Yeah, they could be, yeah. Little yeah, stacker really bracelet like yeah. components. Definitely. Just one little connector. Beautiful. Would you use little gemstones in your stacker bracelets? Or yeah, I mean there's lots of different mixture? sorts, isn't there? But yes, you could do, yeah. Absolutely. Love. You could. Love that idea. In amongst, um, I've got some gorgeous aquamarine. How about in amongst your, um, oh, 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 let me just give you a little, yeah, your heart head mm. pins um, and also your gorgeous chrome dioxide that we've got coming up later on. Very, very, very popular item. Um, not surprised at all. How would you, what, what would you do with these, with the final three on our screens? What would you do? I think I'd be tempted to do like little, just li little wish bracelets with yeah. your lark's head knot Absolutely. either side. Um, nice, you know, and a sliding just, yeah. knot. Lovely. Yeah. Love that idea. Um, okay, right then. Let's do it. Bring you some. And Marie had her eyes on this earlier. Lovely Marie stepped into the studio with her doggy as well. Mm. He's not allowed to be on air though, because because he is because he's a blind dog. Um, she's not allowed to see be on air. Um, okay, but she was eyeing this up. She was like, "Ooh, look at that! It's like a lemon sorbet, isn't it?" Eighty carats, four pound forty-six. That's a random price, isn't it? That's the beauty of Agate. It's a great uh, stash builder um, because it's affordable. It's still a rare, precious, beautiful gemstone. Look at these lovely mm. patterns and textures that you get. It is like what's it, is it called? Syllabub. Is it syllabub? Yes. Yeah. A lemon like, syllabub. Mm. Mm. I've got mm. I've got a lemon yogurt to have in the break. Have you? Yeah. Well, it's more of a mousse actually. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just saying, I really like lemony desserts. <clears throat> I like lemon tarts. I do like lemon tarts. Yeah, yeah. lemon meringue. Mm. Oh. Lemon curd. Yeah, lemon like, curd. Yeah. I've had that for a, a long thing about time. lemon desserts generally. So, mm, stop it now. Mm. Yum, 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 yum. Yeah, lemon meringue is my all-time favourite. Part of to a drizzle cake as well. Um, but it's a little bit like that, isn't it? You kind of mm. get almost like you've got the frosting, or you've yeah, got the meringue and then the creamier itself. tones. Yeah. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Hello to you, uh, Sue. Long, you say the strangest things, ladies. <laughs> Toffee toe coin, indeed. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I've never heard of that before. The toffee, toffee penny. Toe. Toff yeah. Um, yeah, the toffee penny. If you look at the toffee penny, that's I'll big never and look flat. The, yes, but I will <laughs> never be able to look at a toffee penny coin <laughs> ever again without thinking of your toe. Um, I have these. Uh, use the yellow and white pearls um, with them on memory wire. Great combination. Mm. I love the idea of that. See, see, Ginny Susie speaks a lot more sense. <laughs> Much more than you and I. I'm not going to be able to have a, have a tin of quality streets now without thinking about your toes. Sorry, sorry. sorry. 
it's ruined fine. it, haven't I? No, no, no it's Sorry. fine. Like I said, I think, to be fair, I started it. <laughs> to be fair. Um, okay, coming up in your, for, in your next hour, we have got amazing, amazing kits. More incredible star buys coming your way. Demos galore. Um, yeah, n so much to see. Don't forget your deal of the day. Don't forget Australian natural champagne diamonds. Um, we'll be back after this. Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Makers, we have some important news to tell you about. On Tuesday the 26th of June, Jewelry Maker is moving home on Freeview to Channel 74. Don't forget that you might need to retune your Freeview box. This should only take a few minutes. So, from the 26th of June, you'll find Jewelry Maker on Freeview, Channel 74. Buying from Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. When we bring an item to you, all the graphics come on screen and this gives you all the information that you will need to know. From the item code to the product description with all of the key information. Then the price comes on and whether you join at the beginning or at the end of the offer, everyone pays the final on screen price. So when you see an item that you would like to buy, simply pick up the phone and dial our free phone number and you'll get through to our UK based call centre. Alternatively, you can join us at www.jurymaker.com and start your jury making journey today. Jury Maker, the one stop shop for all your jury making needs. Jewelry Maker, we're always making improvements to give you a better shopping experience. We've recently upgraded our website to make it more user friendly and easy to navigate around. We now have the guest checkout function, which allows customers to check out quickly without creating an account. Our homepage now informs you with what's currently live on the show, recently aired items, and today's deal of the day. We've improved our website navigation and added new categories to help customers quickly find the products they want. Our online range is growing fast with over 7,000 products available for you to purchase. And don't miss out on hundreds of brand new clearance lines with more added every week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. You can now book Jewelry Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewelry Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate covering a variety of mediums. Once you've found a workshop you would like to attend, simply click on the Book Now button, fill in the required fields, and then press Continue. This will take you through to the Payment page. If you have any questions, you can contact our workshop coordinator at any time by emailing workshop at jewelrymaker.com. We look forward to seeing you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 65,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. 
For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre. Love Jewellery Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewellery Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select Continue as Guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here, you still have the option to create an account if you wish, making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Welcome Jewelry Makers, how are we all? I am joined by the gorgeous, the fabulous, I haven't given you a munch yet. Oh, wow. Claire McDonald. Oh, there's cuddles all around you in the studio. Yeah. I'll send you a virtual one too. Yeah. A virtual cuddle. Um, Okie dokie, loads to bring you today, including one of the most luxurious kits that I think we've ever compiled here at Jewelry Maker. It is all about Burmese sapphire and sterling silver. So that's coming up in a few moments' time. Absolutely exquisite jewelry that Claire created. Probably some of the most memorable jewelry, I have to say. Yes, it's a, yeah, amazing. Uh, kit. Really, really gorgeous. Um, and if you want the perfect launch to go alongside it, you know, think of the sterling silver wire <clears throat> that you've got coming up in the next kit with this DVD. Now, it was launched initially on our birthday week and it came in a box set, um, beautifully packaged beautifully packaged um, and so each of our designers uh, filmed a DVD for that birthday launch now lots of you actually said um, can you separate them because you know um, you might not do all of those mediums um, so why would it be in one of our biggest mediums here at Jewelry Maker I'm not surprised this is very 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 much in demand so let's talk a little bit about prong setting um, for a second there Claire because prong setting is going to be so useful if you actually master that skill. Yeah, totally. Because you think about all the different uh, gemstones we do and the, and the shapes that we do and all the different wires, whether it be your, like say, your sterling silver or your plated wires, mm -hmm. all the cabochons. Um, so it's a really, really good technique to, um, to master, really, because then you can either just have it on its own mm -hmm. uh, or, or incorporate it with other, you know, anything, any other medium. But if you can set those stones, that's... That's brilliant. So on the DVD, we do lots of different. Um, it's not just sort of the one one type of prong setting. Um, so it's three different projects. Um, so you can do your pendant, or you work with stones that. Um, so like your your cabochons, and then stones with with pavilions. So it's um yeah, it's quite an in depth DVD. So a lot of learning from mm. this one DVD. Yeah, yeah. It's approximately um, sixty minutes, yes, approximately yeah. an hour in total. Um, and like I said, a lot of skills. Um, it, does it include actually a certain amount of weaving in? There? as well uh, there's a little bit there's a little bit of weaving but it's not it's more sort of about the um, actual about the prongs yeah and sort of getting that bit right so, yeah. yeah which is very important I mean, at the end of the day the gemstone tends to be the valuable piece doesn't it the part the value yeah. or the most valuable part and, that, and that's the bit that really you want to get secure isn't yeah it? so it's, it's more about the the prongs I would well say. it's certainly the focal isn't it mm. um, but yeah I mean we stock uh, we bring you sort of your non-drill gemstones we bring you drill gem drill drilled gemstones and also your cabochons um, all of which can be uh, set into prong sets just like this um, it is a really beautiful thing to be able to uh, to be able to do and something that is you, you wouldn't well I shouldn't say you wouldn't I wouldn't be able to do without the, the aid of this DVD um, for those of you that haven't um, bought our DVDs before they're very detailed. They've got fantastic uh, sort of angles as well from the cameras. So you see every single, um, every single sort of shot. Um, inside, let me op open it because you get a booklet as well. We are very well aware that people do learn differently. Mm. Some people are visual, therefore will benefit from the DVD, but some people like to actually read it. So you might have, say you're watching the DVD and you miss something um, and you just want to confirm that, then you can actually just sort of trace back actually on the DVD as well. Yeah, I think it's a really, it's, I love the fact that we've got the booklets now because it is, it's, it's um, one supports the other, doesn't it? Yeah. So. 
absolutely and they're beautiful things i mean look how lovely that is the photography absolutely amazing it's something that i would be very proud to have uh, within my learning library the first time it has been brought to air on its own it was brought initially at the beginning of may for our birthday celebrations in um, a large box set that was um alongside lots and lots and lots of other different guest designers but we understand you know not not everybody does every single medium yeah. You know, we tend to have our favourites or we tend to have ones that you want to move on to next, etc. So um, we've decided, we'll, 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 you know, to, 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 if we could have done it, that is, uh, we've decided to do as you requested. So um, the introduction, the prong set pendant um, on the front, you've actually got a prong set ring um, with the pavilion, which is what is actually uh, um, pictured and the prong set ring with a cabochon. So they are they completely different? Yes, yes they are, yeah. The actual are. prong setting technique. Yes, yeah. It's a um, different way of, of setting it, so that it, um, because, it, because it's about how you want it to be as secure as possible. So, um, yes, you're going to build the, the, the ring shanks, but it's a different number of wires. So, yes, they are. They're different. Completely different shapes, so different, you have to treat yes. it in different yeah. ways. Yeah. Um, are you ready? Now, do we have enough of these to go around, Roz? We've got a big quantity, well, a good quantity, Roz said, actually. Um, so, yeah, that doesn't necessarily mean big. Um, so you've got to remember that our birthday week is one of the largest uh, sort of weeks in terms of in terms of sales um, so I would imagine I would imagine that you know probably hundreds if not thousands of them sold them in the original launch so maybe we're back to maybe we're down to the final I don't know 100 200 of them grab it grab it whilst you can beautiful beautiful craftsmanship there um, you don't you don't want you don't want them to protrude too much do no, you? No I think that's the whole thing isn't it with the with the the prong setting it so that it's it's secure and it holds it but it doesn't overpower it's almost yeah. it's not invisible but it, it doesn't, you know, it's, it's a very discreet setting. Yeah, love that. You know, as you would imagine it being cast or set, you know, we, yes, buy, we yeah. buy prong set rings, which have usually been, um, has been cast within a mould itself. Yeah. This, you're creating your very selves with wire work, which is a, a real, real skill. 9.95 jewellery makers. Now, just to give you a heads up, I have got wire, sterling silver wire coming up in, um, in the next kit. So all of these, can I use them for the prong setting? Yeah. Yes, perfect. Yeah, absolutely perfect. They'd be yeah. amazing in the prong setting. They would. They would be. They would be. I'm pretty sure that that's the gauges that I use. So yeah, that's that would be. They'd be great. Your perfect gauges. Yeah. Look at you all there. My goodness, gosh, we're inundated. I shouldn't be surprised. I'm definitely oh, I've not just surprised. Seen, I've just seen Ros from Warwickshire. I met Ros from Warwickshire on Saturday. Actually. Did you? Yeah, she's lovely. Do you know? I always get mixed really up lovely. because Ros from Warwickshire, and we've got a Ros from Worcestershire, and we've got a Ros, Ros from the West Midlands. Oh. That's that Ros, by the way. That's that Ros. Um, there's, there's quite a few Roses actually, but hello. Yeah, did I meet her? Uh, it, she, was on, she was on the photography workshop. Yes, I did. Yeah. Yes, I did. It's nice, Amazing. isn't it, when you see people and then... Yeah, what a face to a name. Yeah. It is, it is. A lovely, uh, a lovely group of uh, ladies there. So many of you on those phone lines. Check out those baskets. And um, we've got a good quantity, but not a huge quantity. And it's not limitless, Roz actually says. So do you know if these are ever going to be reprinted again? I don't. I have no idea. I mean, it's that we're sort of like not... Well, I'm not involved in that side of things, but I don't know. I mean, they're... I don't know. The thing is, I've had DVDs that have, like, not been... I've got, you know, I've been very limited edition, then I've, I've not been done again. And if you think about it, we do, we do do that deliberately sometimes. And the reason for that is because, you know, those amazing works of art, we want to keep limited edition mm. effectively and, and for yourselves as well, jewellery makers. So um, I, I can't guarantee that this will actually be reprinted. I, I can't say it's definitely not, but um, we haven't heard otherwise. 9.95 hundreds are, sell, are flying out the door. A perfect gift, perfect gift. Hi, Leanne. Uh, this is a great DVD. Help me so much. Thank you, Claire, Aww. for your talent. She is, isn't Thank she? Thank you very much. Thanks, Leanne. So, Thank you know, you. I mean, she, she's, she's beautiful. She's pretty funny as well, but she's also pretty clever. <laughs> you are funny. <laughs> Am I? Yeah. Oh, thanks. You chuckled That's when lovely. I said that, but you are. You are, you are funny. Thanks. I'm very, very, very talented. Um, yeah, so if you've, ever, if you've ever been challenged by wire work, and not just prong setting, um, like I said, we filmed a DVD this morning, very early, very, very early hours this morning as well. So, um, yeah, Claire, Claire, will, Claire will walk you and talk you through every single step. 
Um, and that's that's the brilliant thing, though, isn't it? Because I'm you're thinking now. You know, when you uh, you look at these different techniques, when you when you start putting them all together, there's nothing really to stop you. You could um, so in the DVD we did this morning. Yeah. If you if you've mastered your prong setting, you could you could make alterations and, and do it with the prong setting there. So it's they are all know, skills, aren't yeah, they? Yeah. And and you know when when you sort of um, when you feel comfortable with it, you know you can mix mix them all together and. You know, do your own variations on on things. Let me just open this up and just very quickly, very uh, very briefly, just flip through the booklet as well, because um, like I said, don't no, don't discard these. Um, maybe even photocopy it just in case, um, because you know all yeah, because a lot of work goes into all of those because it's um, you know it's the writing out, the sort yeah. of the step by step um, instruction. So yeah, the photography. Oh yeah. look, there you are. Yeah, there you are. Yeah. <laughs> Oof, there we go. We've already zoomed, yeah. You don't know. We already zoomed. We, we already zoomed in on your face. I know. I, th well. I saw. I caught like a, a glimpse. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for that. That's all right. But yeah, great photography. So you can actually see yes. see very clearly as well when 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 your hands are stationary too. Um, but actually, it comes with step by step and instructions it's Sam, as isn't well. It, that does the photography. Yes. Who is so? He's ever so good. He's who do, who so does good. who does our workshops yes. as well? Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I, yeah. I stepped in there the other day. He's very adamant about what he likes and what he doesn't like. Just is Sam. Oh, he's really stroppy. Yeah. He is oh, really stroppy. I wouldn't have called him stroppy. I love him. I love him. But he's like. He, he's so good at what he does. So I said, what's yeah. wrong then, Sam? What do, we, what do people do wrong? He said, most of what you see in an image, in most photographs. And I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. So they yeah, paired I, everything, everything down. So they were just doing a lot on a, on a white background yeah. when, um, when yeah. I went in. Yeah. And the work that the ladies had done was uh, beautiful, absolutely beautiful, they really do, you know, often, talented. Often, really you talented. know, your amazing craftsmanships do, do need just that simplicity white background mm. show off your skills um so at much like what's on your screens just here which are, you know very simple photography hi june saying got mine so happy as missed out last time love claire's work and can't wait to have a go oh, thanks, june. um yeah make Hope sure you, like you send it. that picture in june now yeah have a go and make sure you send your pictures into the mm. wall of fame because we love admiring your creations as well still lots of you dialing through i've still got people with it in their baskets like i said we had um initially we we, we had thousands of these on the on the actual launch um in the actual box set and it came with how many different dvds was it 10 eight yeah, eight yeah. was it eight other dvds so this is one of eight I think it might have been. I think it was eight, wasn't it? Was it eight? I know there were a couple of um, there were a couple of a uh, couple of wire work ones. We're just looking. Did you have two in? I in did. Yes. You yeah, had I was two. asked to do two. Yeah, which was which was very nice. Very nice. Amazing. Um, so. We've also managed to squeeze a few more of your DVDs into this morning show mm. for, for for the die-hard Claire McDonald fans. Is that, is that my mum? What's that? You, my mum. No, mom. there's lots of die-hard Claire McDonald fans. Lots of us. Um, so what we're going to do is pop them on pre-order for you. So um, if you want any other Claire McDonald DVDs, speak to our contact centre. You'll be able to get them. Um, and if you're with us on the web, you'll also see, you'll be able to see them. Um, still some of those available, but let's move on to this kit because this is very, very, very limited. Now, don't worry. I've got kits that are more affordable, so don't worry about that. But um, in this first... In, in this first hour, um, kit hour, it's more of a, let's just say, a considered, a considered purchase. I touched on it earlier on, and I do, I, I, I'd, I'd like to think I'm pretty straight, and I'd like to think that, you know, I say it as it is, we get, we get, we can give you affordability, and we can also really uh, sort of uh, um, tick all the boxes of those that want to spend that little bit more and get a sort of a higher investment, higher quality of those gemstones as well. I don't think that's a negative myself. I think that's a really good positive that we're given that variation. So there's 15 of these available in the world. Um, now you get a lot of sterling silver, but you're also getting not one, but two strands of Burmese sapphire. And it, it is firstly a long strand. Mm -hmm. That's the other thing I need to point out. Our gems and distinction strands used to be this, used to be half that. Look what you're getting now. Look how beautiful it is. Absolutely amazing clarity of Burmese sapphire. So I've doubled that over just so you can see the length. Yeah, look at that. It's gorgeous, isn't it? Just pop that wire DVD on your screens. 
So you can get that as well, one of Claire McDonald's DVDs. Look at that. Beautiful clarity. That is synonymous to uh, Burmese sapphire. That's why it is so clo uh, so highly regarded within the industry, or I should say one of the locations which is, has got amazing, uh, amazing respect uh, because the, the quality and the variations of colours are teamed alongside exceptional diaphanity and clarity as well. I mean, again, if you were to see this set into a platinum or into an 18 karat gold, this level, this grade um, of Burmese sapphire, you'd be talking about four figures. You would be, wouldn't you? Um, and it's that kind of calibre that I would imagine to be set in two golds and your golds only. Look at that. When it comes to your pink sapphire or your fancy sapphire as it's referred to, you know, the more vibrant, the more intense that saturation is, the more desirable it is. And that has got that almost like a, like a flamingo, like a fling, flamingo colour. Now, can I just point out that this strand on its own, if it was to be sold on its own, would be £139.95, this strand on its own. But you've got so much more within this mm. kit. It's going to go a long way, a long way. Now, the strand itself, do you have the, the, the actual me uh, measurements, etc., Roz? Um, the actual measurement of this strand, just because I think it's really important, important to point out, like I said, our strands are not short. That's, that's mm. amazing quality. And in your pink sapphire, that's a 28 centimetre strand. That is double what our, um, what our Gems of Distinction strand used to be previously. You're getting there 26.5, so 26 and a half carats in total um, of amazing heat only treated, which actually isn't classed as a, a laboratory treatment. So this is as natural as it comes. Then you're also getting another strand, a second strand of Burmese sapphire in Oh, it's this amazing, amazing blue. Yeah. Um, this strand on its own, if you were to buy it individually outside of this kit, is $99.95. And the reason why they are so highly priced is because the quality is, without doubt, the finest that we've got within our mm. vault. You know, I can bring you sapphire at £10. I can. I can bring you pink sapphire and blue sapphire at £10, but they won't be anywhere near... They'll be beautiful, they'll be lovely, don't get me wrong, but they won't be anywhere near the value and the beauty as what's on your screens right now. We cater for all budgets here at Jewelry Maker. This, I, hey listen, is, it is, isn't going to be for everybody because it is more considered, but look at what you're getting. I'm, I always mention the words heirloom, legacy. It's that kind of calibre. So already, um, you're get, I can just inform you, you're getting an amazing deal. But we're still not done because you're getting four spools of sterling silver wire. Uh, four reels, which include, um, let me just read this. So you've got your 0.8, your 0.4, and your 0.25. Five meters of your 0.4, that's this one just here, five meters there. One meter of your 0.8, and you're getting two meters of your 0 0.25 there. Um, Claire, are these the essential gauges for sterling silver wire? Yeah, very much so, because obviously you've got your structural wire, haven't you, in your 0.8. Yep. Uh, you've got lots of your weaving wire in your 0 0.4. And then what you might find with some of the, um, you know, when you've got gemstones of this quality, that the drill hole can be smaller. So that's where you'd use your um, your. So you could actually wire. thread with sterling silver Absolutely, as well. Absolutely, yeah. How amazing Absolutely, would that be? Yeah. Um, we are talking very, very high end, but I mean, every piece that Claire has created... I wasn't joking when I said some of the most memorable jewellery that um, I think we've seen this, this year. Um, I love everything about it. And I loved Claire's demonstration, which I know she's going to be treating with you, you with today. Look at that. Burmese sapphire and sterling silver. The colours are incredible, aren't they? Absolutely incredible. They really are. Um, to the earrings, those lovely little leaf-style earrings with that little cluster. I've only got 15 of these available. You've got a saving of over £60 with this kit. That's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. £60 saving. Outside of this kit, you're going to be talking um, You're going to be talking £100 uh, for the blue, over £100 uh, for the actual pink uh, Burmese, um, and, I, and I couldn't even... and 20 odd pounds worth of your sterling silver wire outside of this kit. Collectively, you get that amazing savings. I've only got 15 of these available for £199.95. I mean, the reality is... That that gorgeous ring just there, it, it, that's, that is solid precious sterling silver and nothing else. 
you know, yeah. uh, you yeah. obviously your gemstones, but there's no other additions um, outside of this kit. That in itself would be valued at what's on your screen right now or sold at what's on your screen right now, don't you think? At least. Mm. Yeah. At least. Yeah. I mean, I know that you There was you another don't... bit as well, sorry. Oh, I, I must have left that outside, sorry. So I'd put some of it in um, in a slider bracelet as well because, mm. we, you know, we see a lot of those. So, you know, if um, time-wise, if you're selling on as well... Um, uh, no, it was on a. It was on a. Um, I had put it on a on a stand. Sorry, I should have brought it in. Um, but so time wise, if you're just looking at that, you don't want to spend a lot of time um, doing the pieces as well. Just just stranding it on, um, you know. And that's a really wearable, beautiful jewellery, and that's not not too many. Um, not too many of the gemstones. So you can see, so something like that, where I've got what, uh, two, three, four, five, five gemstones mm -hmm. out, of, out of, oh, like you said, the, the really, really long strands. They are there. long strands. The blue yeah. is slightly shorter. The blue is 18. So that's more of our standard mm. length of, mm. um, of, uh, of the actual Burmese sapphire. So this is kind of the, what we see in those gold boxes, that length, like I say, it, it, it's, it's been that length for as long as I've known it, about 18, uh, stretch 17 uh, centimetres. But the actual pink is much longer, mm. much longer. So, yeah, I'd agree. So you've yeah. used how many of those, Rhonda? Four five, or five? yeah. Five of them. Five Do you think there. you could get your money back? I think, I for think the kit? Could, I think you absolutely could, yeah. Yeah. The I mean, look at the, the quality and the colours. Yeah. Truly, truly, truly incredible. And all of that gorgeous sterling silver. Uh, what are you going to demonstrate today? So I'll show you... Um, Shall I show you how to do one of the little leaves? Yes. Shall I show you how to do that? Right, okay. So I'm just gonna start off. So it's a nice little um, quick make. Message for you, Claire, coming from Sue saying, uh, that ring is exceptional. I need your brain, Claire. Oh, thanks, Sue. You're That's very lovely, welcome to have it? it, yeah. It's not, it's not that good at some things. <laughs> It is a really, <laughs> really, really beautiful, beautiful ring. I know we were raving about it as well, Sue. Um, Ross is saying you have to sift through things sometimes. Yes, yeah, you do. You do. Um, no, not really. You're very clever. You like people don't realise that you were actually an engineer. Hmm. <laughs> 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 An engineer before it's your hidden, jewelry it's making. It's hidden well, isn't it? Hidden talents. So yes, so, um, so I'm working with my structural wire. So I've just, I'm going to go around. Um, so I've got, <laughs> I'm going to go around something like quite the, the top of the, the nail varnish. Okay. And because it's working with the sterling silver, um, so, so you could do it with your ring mandrel if that if that were in reach. You could you could do that. You like well. to use objects. Yes, though, I don't do you? because look in that one one piece there. I've got mm. I've got two different sizes. Yeah. On one on one tool. Yeah. Okay. So mm. And it does your nails as well. And look, it's all covered up. You know, I can't you can't see where it's. How from. long have you had that nail varnish? Quite, I just just, you know, I just think curious I had that to know. When I first started, so I think that's about four years. Yeah. No, but look, but... it's still I can't say where it's from, but look, that's good quality. <coughs> oh can you? Oh, um, yes, you can see there. Sorry. That wasn't... OK. <laughs> <laughs> right, OK. So I've just, I've just used that as the... Uh... <laughs> now, of course, it's sterling silver wire that, 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 that Claire is actually <laughs> demonstrating with you. So you would, you, you, you would like to <laughs> be, a bit, be a bit more frivolous. So, yeah, <laughs> Claire would just... <laughs> yeah, we're just talking about how clever you are, and you're like, no, I've covered it, I've covered it. I've covered one side, Claire. We can still see it's the brand. It's been like that for four years. Mm. Have that. you been saying the same for four yeah, years? Yeah, probably, yeah. Probably. <laughs> so, would, yes, would okay. you, going back to what I just said, would you, would you agree, you're, you've got to be a little bit more scrupulous with yourself? Yes, you wire. have. So, in anything like this, if you feel more comfortable to just do it, uh, do it in your plated wire, maybe first, to get, if you wanted to do specific sizes, or to see where's best to hold your pliers, to see, you know, uh, how much pressure, things like that to put on. You know, sometimes you might think, oh, I might use my round nose pliers to uh, make shapes in the wire, but when you actually do it in your in your prototype, you might see that it, it marks more. Mm -hmm. um, so then you might decide to swap to your chain nose. So I've made like a full circle. I've got a little bit of a, a tail coming up here. So I'm going to just push that, push that together there. So I'm just making that, that little leaf shape in there. 
So I'm going to bring that down and bring that all the way around. So you can see, so I've got, it's a, quite a three-dimensional uh, piece. I'm just going to bring that through and pinch there. So I'm going to pinch it so it's coming down so we, it gives us that central, central vein. Okay. So I'm just going to manipulate that a little bit. And what you'll get, you can see, so you can see it's oxidising on my hands. Um, and that's that's perfectly normal. So I know now that if I uh, if I want to have like a, a little bit of a connector, so I could do a little loop. Oh, sorry, that's my head, isn't it? I might I might stand up. I think I'm sticking my head in the. Uh, that's okay. Whatever you feel comfortable with. So I'm just gonna I'm, I'm gonna have it as just a. Um, uh, I'm not gonna have a loop. I'm just gonna if you're gonna do a loop, you just you could just uh, leave a little bit extra <laughs> and have a little little openable loop there. I'm just going to bring that in, so we'll snip that off so it's a bit clearer as well. So I'm going to take that, so I've got supporting all of it with my, uh, in between my thumb and my finger, and I'm going to just bring that round, so all the way at the back, and try and get it so that it's right at the tip there. Okay, so I'm going to leave that there. So you've got now your, almost like a little, little leaf or a little coffee bean. So can I... Um, can I use your, uh, the wire from the kit, please? Yes, all right? of course you can. Which one? 0.25 uh, or 0.4? The, the 0.4, please. I'll just pass it all over. Thank there you. Okay. So what you're going to do now is you're going to start to do your, your weave on here. So you could, um, you could do it with your 0.25, but I think, I think the better, um, it's better to do it with your 0.4 because it's you're going to get you're going to get nice detail. It's just going to you're going to be able to see it a little bit a little bit more. Because we've got a, a closed shape here, we do have to cut it off the off the reel. So unfortunately, you can't um, you can't do it so that you can't feed the whole of the reel through. So what you're going to do, you're going to think about it and do like a figure of eight weave. So it's going across, and we're actually going across three different. Um, uh, pieces of base wire. So we've got this side, just move that away. So we've got this side, we've got the central line, and then we've got the side coming over here. So, so even though you've got like three three base wires, you're going to do exactly the same. So it's it's all it is is going through and remembering that you can see on this side, I've got a much bigger, a longer length of wire to cover than this this length here and this length here. So what I'll have to do is I'll have to compensate for the amount of wraps that I do and so I'll probably have to do more along this side but this that will hopefully become clearer as I start working it. So I'm just going to anchor on so a couple of few wraps and I'm going to come over and through. So you can see I'm just I'm encouraging it by doing a little little circle and what I might do just to make it a bit easier I'm just going to raise that up a little bit so I'm just pushing it up there. So that, that means I haven't got to, rather than going in and out and up, hopefully I can just slide that under that central line. So let's have a look, just moving a little bit. So I'm going to bring that all the way through. So we've just popped on your screen the other birthday DVD one that you did. Yeah, so, so that, that one, that, that wire weaving, I would say is a, um, a perfect companion because what that will show you is that shows you the different weaves that, that you will do on the um, on the ring ring shank. So yeah, I would say that's it's a perfect um, you know they work very well together. So I've come underneath that central line. All I was doing then was just locking that that in place. It was moving a little bit. So I'm going to come all the way around, back through, and pull it down. And I've done one wrap on that, that central line and come out. This is the footage of the DVD, um, like I said, the second one that Claire did um, for our birthday. Yes, yeah, so you can, the bottom of the screen. You can see, this, so it's that one, it's techniques. It's like super speed weaving, that is, isn't it? I don't do it, um, don't do it that quickly on there. Um, but you can see the tools that, that you, might, you might find useful. So all the time I'm just I'm just wrapping it around and I go back to this this central central line. So again I'm going to go through and up and back over. So now what I'd start to do is I'm going to start to on the on the largest side that longest side there 
I'm going to come down. So whereas I've done two wraps on this side and two wraps on this side, I want this, this area to fill up a little bit quicker. So I'm going to come round. So this time I'm going to go one. So we'll do one full wrap round. Two. And the more silver wire that we put in, the, the greater the, the, you know, the gram weight ultimately. Yes, yeah, yeah. So if you're selling on, you'd obviously have to, you know, keep, a, keep an eye out for um, how heavy the piece was. But you can see, you can see how this is going to start to build up now. So I'm just going to have one wrap on there compared to the three on this side and go through. See, all you're going to keep doing is, and this is this is where your, your weaving DVD will come in handy because you can see, it sort of, it'll show you the difference of, if I do a lot of, of coils and wraps just on these outer wires and then go over, so I've done about four or five on that side, you're going to actually see more. Can you see, I'll hold it up in a minute so you'll be able to see the gap through. So even by using the, the same techniques but just different variants, you'll get very, very different effects. So again, one wrap on that side, and I'll do one more, and then I'll hold it up so that hopefully you can start to see how this is starting to take shape. But yeah, so, so by doing this, this is these sort of, this wee gives you the, the veins on the, on the leaf. So. The leaf skeleton. Yes. Because that's what you're doing effectively, aren't you? Yeah, absolutely. So... I'll do just bring that over there and then you can see how that's that's starting look to that. look. Can you see how you would you would fill that fill that all in? Yeah, so you can see there. Love it. And it's you know, you can see because I've lifted that up, it's quite a 3D, 3D yeah, shape. It is. And you can just turn that top little bit into a into a bale or a connector. And just trim that off. You could either do it as a wrap loop or leave it like that because so, you've got quite a strong wire there. So it's an openable loop there. And that's how you do your little little leaf. So, so, so beautiful. Thank you. You're welcome. Perfect um, um, wire as well to go alongside this DVD. So if you wanted to um, get hold of uh, the wire work weaving DVD, it is... I don't know why it's like it's fast forward thing. Mm. Fast forward. I was oh that was me. I was with you on this one. I can remember now. I remember the stag. We didn't work that quickly, did we? No. Um, <laughs> yeah. So and yours won't be fast forwarded, by the way. So um, yeah, yeah, a perfect, perfect combination. You're sterling silver wire, mm. and you're getting Burmese sapphire times two um, with this DVD. Nine ninety five only. Thank you, Claire, so you're very much. Welcome. And thank you for um, demonstrating again. Right? Would you like some more wire? Um, we can't have Claire on our show without treating you with wonderful wires. Ah. It's just, it's just not right. You know? Um, okay, so we've got Artistic Wire by the Dozen coming your way. And I'm going to be bringing it to you in what, sorry? Firstly? Oh, the silver first. This one? Oh, this one. Why have they called it silver if it's not silver? Yeah, give me the code. That's the good one. That's a good one. You watch. It's going to be the... There we go. Here we go. Isn't that strange? Why have they called it silver if it's not silver? Because it's the first one on the picture. Okay. Oh, silver plated. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so... You're actually getting here silver plated wire, obviously, um, in 28 different gauges and... and Sorry, the 28 gauge, that's the thickness of it, which basically works out as a 0 0.3. Um, four and a half metres on, um, on each of these spools. Mm, it's very deceptive, isn't it? How, really uh, deceptive. How much you've got on there? Um, at £12.95. Um, very rare do we see you know, this many colours on our screen, certainly on the live show. Very, very, very rarely. So, uh, a <clears throat> great opportunity to get hold of, you know, a real wire work palette, for want of a better description, for just over a pound per spool. So if you think about all the different, you know, the different colours that you've got in there, and you did something like the, um, 
the, the little leaf, mm -hmm. you know, there's nothing to start, you know, you can absolutely do that technique, but you could do it with the green, couldn't you? Add in yeah, some lovely with the green. The oranges for your, you know, autumnal colours. And don't forget that this is silver plated. Mm. You know, you are getting your precious metal here. Artistic wire is very much considered as um, one of the most quality, would you say? Quality yes, wires? Yeah, it's um, a very yeah, it's good brand. Um, yeah. I have got different gauges if you want the different gauges. Basically, the higher, much like your seed beads, the higher the number, the finer the gauge. Is that right? Because um, I'm looking at the 22 gauge yeah. and it's thicker, yeah. yeah. Um, so don't worry, I have got different gauges if you want to get your structural wires and your weaving wires and, and all of these different colours. They come in packets like this. So um, like I said earlier on, it's a great way of actually getting a mixed bag of, uh, of colours in one yeah, sole like purchase. Yeah, like a full rainbow colour, isn't yeah. it? A full rainbow colour. Because, you know, even when we would do like wire work shows, mm -hmm. we don't often get 12 colours. No. I, I don't. I, I don't think we've ever had like. I've never been on a show where they've had all that. Not and you that think much about, selection. Um, I'm thinking about some of the DVDs now that that you've had uh, that we've bought on. So like on the wire wire writing. Um, yeah, DVD. There's a of how to do a little wire work rainbow, and so you need you need those uh, to to be able to do that. So you've got your full your full sort of colour palette. You know, thinking about like Alison Tarry's lovely yeah. you know, structural pieces, <gasps> the dolphins. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. We launched her dolphin DVD. Yeah, wonderful thing. Rachel Norris's pieces. So to have all those colours there. Because you can really make those pieces pop, can't you, with a bit of colour. Yeah, like I said, we've totally. had bumblebees, all yep. those kind of things, actually just putting a, that mm. colour of wire in between. Um, okay, shall we do... Right, let's do the Argentian wire. Right, let's not get confused with these. So I'll put that there. Right, Argentian wire is a relatively new thing to the um, to the industry. It is um, the purest, the purest of gold, and it's tarnish resistant, which I think is amazing because I think most sterling silver wearers will agree that it's very, very, very frustrating when your wire, um, or rather your jewellery, tarnishes and you have to constantly polish it then um, so yeah this is the purest variety and um, it was I, I, it's, it's not that many years in the actual industry um, it's called argentium um, and it's as I said new, I think isn't it it's yeah, quite, yeah yeah it's purer than nine uh, nine two five um, sterling silver wire um, you're getting a meter long here it's incredibly incredibly soft as the graphic indicates this is our start price but we're not stopping there um, it's very much favored by some of the very very high-end uh, jewelry makers out there just because like I said it's tarnish resistant 1995 um, do you use Argentium wire? I haven't I haven't yet um, and I, I would love to because of the thing you know doing a lot more of the the weaving um, you know and so and I think I think it says you get four four meters there so oh, did that, I say that, one that, that four that becomes wow, doesn't it? That's four totally. meters you know when you're working with so and and again this so this sort of weave here is on the um, on the that weaving DVD, as are all of these ones here. If you were going to do something in, you know, with your high-end gemstones, and you didn't, you wanted to have that that look with your, um, you know, your precious metals, and to know that it's not going to tarnish, so you know, you don't have to worry about that. That'd be really good to, to always to work have with. that brightness mm, um, effectively, great. yeah, without a, a actually sub, sort of submerging it in your sort of silver solutions, etc. Yeah, yeah. Which, uh, believe me, once you've done that once, you'll always have to do it. You'll always will. Have you? I always say that prevention when it comes to sterling silver um keeping things clean with those little tabs that you put you know the mm. little uh, the little tabs that we do sell here as well you get in packets prevention is much better than curing because um whilst it can come lovely after actually cleaning that you'll always constantly have to be doing that with argentium wire you don't need to worry about it 1995 thank you for correcting me four meters you're getting here so that's amazing well done um shall we do um rose and yellow now oh so you could do a three-tone piece these are just tie on. These are wrapped I together. I feel like I might have to um, borrow this. Mm. Look at that. Rose and yellow. Gold filled wire. Wow. Um, who wants a big price crash? You can really see the rose and the yellow, can't you? You can see that difference in tone. Mm. It's a, a slight introduction. They've been bound together here in the studio, but you can you, you can make it out, can't you? So hang on a second. Are you getting four meters um, across both those colours? Twenty six gauge. So that's working out at what? What would you say? Point four, point six. 
I think it's a point four. A point four. Is it point four? Certainly looks like a point four. Twenty two ninety five. Amazing. We don't often see the gold or the rose gold wire, and do I, we? No, and I would work with I'd work with if you've got the, the you know, the um, the heavier gauge wire, say the 0.8 silver. I mean they look lovely together, don't they? They really do. You know, if you if you did the um, if you did something like that type of weave, so you've got your um, your, your base wire in your, your sterling silver and then you went over in the rose gold. Create the that gold. three tone. Yeah, that would look lovely. It's a what gauge? 0.4 gauge. There we go. Um, I, I actually, I'm trying to recall, Claire, if you've ever actually had the gold-plated sort of uh, precious metal wire, um, or in the in the rose gold. Mm. I'm trying to recall. I haven't seen it. Very limited though, so it's going to be first come, first serves. Can't say any fairer than that. Pat, uh, sorry, Pam, you were straight in there. Um, well done to you, Kent as well. Candy, good luck. Parvinda, good luck. I've got people on the phone, so I can't see your names as yet. We've got a slight delay here in the studio, um, but don't you worry. If you're there, then um, I can all I can do is keep everything crossed and can you imagine netting because that would be the ideal gauge netting your um, that amber the big amber oh. um, piece that you've got there because we always say don't we how lovely it would be to be able to do it in um, in your gold or, or the rose gold I'd definitely be, be amazing that. combination mm. could I possibly use my natural Australian oh. champagne diamonds wow look seriously wow they're oh amazing, word. aren't they? Yeah. <gasps> Look at those. They're coming up as well. Very they go perfectly, don't they? They that? really do. The quality mm. of both of those. You can see them together, can't you? Only eight of these left, and your Australian diamonds are coming up a little bit later on. Um, <clears throat> we are an hour and 15 minutes away from your deal of the day. Micro-faceted beauty um, in your lemon quartz and, of course, your garnet. So make sure you stay tuned for that. But up next, though, we've got a beautiful Starbucks. Who wants stock up your stash? It's a no-brainer having it opportunity. Me. Yes, you know, Please. kind of like yeah, disposable income, affordable, that kind of that kind of yes, genuine gemstone opportunity. Because as I said earlier on, um, you know, we can offer you your more considered items. You know, you think about the the, the, the Burmese sapphire. You think about the champagne diamonds we've got coming up. They're not something that. Every single one of us will be able to treat ourselves too. Maybe on that day. However, I can bring you, I can bring you affordable as well. And this is one of those star buys. It features beautiful March babies, be, be aware, um, aquamarine. And you're getting a variation of those tones. So it's all about ombre today. Um, imagine ombre your ap mm. aquamarine. It's making me think of Mark straight away. Look at those colours. Yeah, so you're getting greens, almost like tealy colours. You've got um, sort of your sky blues. I love the fact that this one's actually more like a golden barrel, I think, myself, uh, mm. rather than that and green. But that's a big positive if you're getting those in there. Yeah, so if you wanted to ombre, you absolutely could. If you wanted to keep it completely random, you can do that too. Um, this is totally and utterly natural. It hasn't been treated. Um, and it hasn't been heated to intensify those saturations, um, which it gains its colour from iron, um, Aquamarine. It's a member of the Barrels family that gains its colour from the presence of iron. Um, it needed no enhancement, Seven ninety-five. Now, I've been talking throughout the entirety of the morning about how much I need rounds. I need mm. rounds non-faceted and faceted. They're the German stone that shape that I use the most absolutely yeah I'm thinking I, I need that as the base for um you know the the charms that we that we got the gold ones you yes. could just do couldn't you lovely stretches has got a lovely drill hole and then um, yeah and then put all you know, we had lots of different the stars as well any of those charms oh I really really could do some serious spending mm. today yeah really yeah. feel tempted to do it as well 7.95 I'm not going to feel guilty about this kind of price tag, though. Not no. for genuine, uh, uh, genuine aquamarine. Um, very popular again. Lots of you checking out straight away. Congratulations! And it is the colour of summer, isn't it? I all whenever I see aquamarine of quality, I always think about picnics. 
mm. and beautiful meadows. Yeah, like lying back and seeing the sky. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. The clouds, mm. like making out shapes in the clouds. Yes. Very idyllic, isn't yeah. it? And if you do want to, um, if you're going to arrange like the um, the different tones like that, what I sometimes do is if you if you're arranging them because um, they can look just one one sort of uh, difference in colour can make it look very very different. So mm. take take photos as well. So if you're taking little sections, take a photo on your phone and then rearrange it and then and then sort of compare yeah, yeah. the two because so you've got under, so many under different tones. Fluorescent in there. light as well. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Half the stock has gone already. Multi buying going on with this. I'm not surprised. Um, perfect with your deal of the day, I do think. Let me just grab them. Just you know, contrast of the opaque alongside the oh, microfaceting. I think that looks lovely, mm. doesn't it? Um, perfect alongside. Here you go. Here's another example. Maybe some kunzite. Some really gorgeous mm. feminine kunzite. I could go on and on and on because, to be honest, aquamarine is a is a very complimentary gemstone. Yeah, it'll go isn't with it? everything, won't it? Yeah. Um, I'm going to leave those final few there because I'm going to move on to. Oh, I need these. Mm. See, they we... would work very nicely with it. Yeah, I haven't seen. Um, Can't seen that remember yet. the last time I saw this shape. Now they are beautiful drops, top to bottom drilled. I almost should. Sh I feel like I should be showing it that way. Do you see where I'm coming from? Um, because they can be. Cascading them, mm. can't they? Yeah. Um, you mentioned mentioned uh, tiaras. Um, yeah, be perfect with that hair one with the cones, cashews, yeah. Hair vines, amazing. Yeah, with the cashews, um, totally and utterly. Um, 100% genuine pearls here. So look at that smoothness of the nacre surface. You know, beautifully blemished three free. Um, you've got. A really lovely sh uh, shape and size that actually we don't see frequently. Seven by five millimeters. And whilst, yes, they are drops, but they are almost oval drops, aren't they? As opposed to having a narrower top to the bottom itself. Eight pounds ninety-five, Ross. Is that is it? Is that is that what you think? That's what she says. I want people to get these. She's only got twenty-nine. She says I want them all to sell out. Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. Well, that's that's a price tag that I think would work. Um, Roz is saying the more we empty the vault, the more we can bring in. Well, yes, that's very true. We don't want to have stock that sort of stays stagnant, do we? We always want them to be sort of fresh. Look at that, an amazing strand of chrome dioxide that's coming up a little bit later on. Um, I've got the clasps and the head pins to go alongside it. Look at those together. Mm. I think I just have one chrome dioxide in, in yeah, the centre nice. of those. The shapes work really well. Yeah, as well as perfect. The Absolutely perfect. Or maybe even alongside your Australian diamonds. Mm. Look at those. Australian champagne diamonds, completely and utterly natural. Yeah, just one of those coming up in 10 minutes time, your Australian diamonds. Um, the reality is you can use them with everything. Um, I made my own headdress for my wedding day and I used 0.25 wire, some lace and I literally sewed pearls just like this into, uh, into the headdress. So simple, mm. um, but I couldn't get hold of them for ages. Well, no, like you say, we don't, we don't see them very often, do we? So... And I always think about the, um, again, if you do this, uh, um, you can do designs where you, so you wire them in, like, so like you did with the, either your 0.25 or your mm -hmm. 0.4, and you wire it around, so to create a flower around a jump ring base, so that almost like creates a daisy, a daisy look too, so each of those pearls would be a, be a petal. Love that. Absolutely love that idea. Oh, it hundred six double four six double five. all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Well done. So lovely being with you. Now, somebody would like to know what B stands for. It stands for bleaching. Bleaching. So these, you can get pearls which are naturally ivory colour. You can get pearls which are um, naturally, well, any colour really. Not any, but a variety of colours. Sometimes um, they'll actually bleach them to brighten them. So that's what that actually stands for. Don't turn your nose up at that. They're still genuine pearls, of course. Uh, um, at the end, of, at the end of the day, it's, in my opinion, it's no difference to us putting a little bit of makeup on. Treatments mm. they just enhance what the you know the beauty. Um, Okie dokie. Let's bring you some gorgeous amethyst. Is it this one? Look at the size on this. Here we go. Ten. Carrots of amazing amethyst. That would be perfect, oh. wouldn't it, for um, 
DVD this morning. The, oh, amazing with the DVD. Mm. Are we allowed to sort of give us... No. Are I we, don't know. I don't know. Her. Let's just say it'd be perfect with things like cabochons. Wire. Wire. Well, I, get, I think most people have guessed that, yeah, Claire, probably. to be honest. Mm. Let's just say, let's just say it might feature heart shapes. It might. Might. Mm. £3.95. How amazing would this be as a ring mm. if you got the prong set DVD? Yeah, be great. <gasps> Imagine this actually as a prong set ring. That would be absolutely incredible. 40 by 14 millimetres in its size. Let me just grab the tweezers just so you can see. Really see the uh, um, sort of the, the internal patterns within this. So you've got wonderful shades of uh, uh, depths of saturation. It's almost like a stained glass window like mm. effect, isn't I'm it? I'm seeing it from that angle. So yeah, it's brilliant. Look at that. Yeah. Bordering on dog tooth amethyst. Does everyone agree with that? Yeah, with the chevrons. Yeah. That, yeah. And is anyone else actually seeing just an element of red coming through? Mm. Which, by the way, red is, is one of the rarest colours to get in, in quartz. Um, we used to say you couldn't get it in quartz until a recent discovery of amethyst. Um, 0800 644 655, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Um, well done. Indeed, yeah, Ben is saying, oh my goodness, 3 95 mm. Exactly, Ben. This is what Rod, Ros does. Lots of you multi-buying on this. It's a lovely shape. You know, you're getting exactly this shape as well, aren't you? And it'd be nice as well with the, the rose gold wire, wouldn't it? To net it, oh. net it with that. All the gold. It's lovely, isn't all it, this, to have all that we've got silver. that? Yeah. Yeah. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. I'd be, again, alongside the dealer day, if you don't do wire work, listen, use, glue these onto backing foundation mm. and actually sew around it. That works well, so lovely. Well, just one lovely. of our bales, because then you'd, yeah. have that, you'd be able to see that lovely red yeah. coming through. That's true. Um, right, then, should we do some rondelles? I haven't seen a Stardust rondelle in a while. Here we go. I'd be... Uh... Did she just shake her rondelles at me? Sorry. I did notice that TikTok TikTok have bought out a new um, they've bought out they've brought out a new a new advert. It's no idea as good, isn't it? No, it's no. There's no shaking. There's no, no catchphrase. There's, oh. no catchphrase. there's no TikToks. Ah, oh, okay. Here we go. Right. So, um, rondelles doesn't really describe these. I actually think they're more like tires. And I know it's not the most beautiful description, um, but it's because. They've got that really, really, really lovely, uh, great width, haven't they? So, 5 to 2.4 millimetres in their thickness. Oh, yes, Ros, they'd be great for stretchy bracelets. Yes! And I'd be putting that lovely little uh, dove and heart charm that we yeah, had earlier on. Yeah, with the um, aquamarine charms, <gasps> they'd be perfect. With and that, the butterflies, yeah. perfect with the butterflies. Yeah. Any gemstones, because mm. they will nestle. They've actually, they're kind of, they've got flat surfaces, so you're obviously not getting a bead as such. Um, yeah, let's just see where I come from with the tyre shape, mm. but they're a beautiful tyre. Ten ninety five for 30 of them in total. Um, great alongside, great alongside your, your kit that you've just had yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. So there are similar ones in there, yeah. Working out at 36 pence each and they're obviously significant in their actual gram weight. 0800 all the donors at jurymaker.com. I feel like we need to have a wakey wakey moment. We are moments away. Mo Hey, listen. Claire's alarm went off at 3.45 this morning. Mm. I didn't get up then, but that okay. was the first but there was still I have to three. set about three alarms. Just the mentality of it. Yeah. Um, mine was 4.30. It's the mentality of it, isn't it? I shall definitely be napping this afternoon. Mm. Um, but we all, we all slip into a mid-morning lull, don't we? Every so often, and I almost have to go, come on, wake up, wake up, wake up. We've got deals coming your way, and they are deals not to be missed, including genuine, natural um, Australian diamonds coming up in about five minutes' time. Um, so do stay where you are. Check out those baskets. You know, it, it, and every time I do that, 
people do all of a sudden respond. So it's like, I get it. We all, we all, we all get sleepy from time to time. It's the middle of the morning, isn't it? Um, so stay where you are on those phone lines. Check out those baskets if you want to guarantee success. Australian natural champagne diamonds are coming up in a few moments' time. Don't forget your deal of the day. More from this wonderful creature. More demonstrations, more inspiration. We'll be back after this. Our jewellery maker community is a fantastic platform to share, learn, chat and make new friends. So why not like our Facebook page and join over 64,000 like-minded people. Jewellery makers, we have some important news to tell you about. On Tuesday the 26th of June, Jewellery Maker is moving home on Freeview to Channel 74. Don't forget that you might need to retune your Freeview box. This should only take a few minutes. So, from the 26th of June, you'll find Jewellery Maker on Freeview, Channel 74. Love Jewellery Maker but don't have an account? You can now purchase items on the Jewellery Maker website through our guest checkout. To do so, select the products you wish to purchase and head over to the shopping basket. Simply enter your email address and select Continue as Guest below. After this, the checkout process is simple. Select your quantity and delivery option and then check out securely. Enter your billing details in either a credit card or PayPal account and proceed to payment. From here you still have the option to create an account if you wish. Making shopping online easier for you. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know, no matter how many times you purchase with Jewellery Maker in the same day, you'll only be charged one fee of postage and packaging. Select our standard delivery for just $3.95, or if you'd like to receive your goods sooner, upgrade to our premium option for $5.95. Jewellery Maker. Create. Wear. Share. At Jewelry Maker, we are always looking at ways to provide you with a fantastic shopping experience. With this in mind, we'd like to welcome you to our new pre-order option. Selected items throughout the day will be put on display and made available for pre-order. When the presenter informs you that the pre-order service is available on an item, this is your chance to pop it into your online basket or speak to one of our brilliant call centre team members and be one of the first to secure your purchase. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewellery Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 65,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewellery Maker. And on to a another amazing, um, rare opportunity. Um, it's, it's, I think it's a well-known fact that diamonds are not the rarest of gemstones out there. I think we all know that, don't we? I mean, they have vast 
uh, vast mines where it literally sort of uh, uh, diggers and huge lorries will almost circle uh, and drive around, sometimes miles in, in their actual sort of uh, their diameter. However, when we start stepping into the world of your fancy diamonds, then that, um, that previous statement is eliminated. We actually refer to coloured diamonds as fancy diamonds. So you can actually get your blues, um, you can actually get your pink, you can get well, lots of different tones. And anybody that uh, follows things like the jewellery editor and places like that will have certainly have seen valuations that have come up just recently um, for millions upon millions of pounds for many, many, uh, many of your fancy diamonds. Now, you can get diamonds, in fact the majority of diamonds actually are um, irradiated. Um, these are naturally coloured, which is very, very exciting, especially when we start talking about champagne coloured. I've, I've got an article here that I just want to read to you sort of certain part, certain chapters if you like, or paragraphs, um, just because I think it explains what a champagne diamond actually is. Um, especially naturally coloured champagne diamonds because effectively once upon a time coloured diamonds weren't really that desirable it was more about your colourless and your colourless only um, however the rise in popularity um, and how frequently they've been seen on lots of different celebrities out there um, has skyrocketed um, you know like I said their wants their need and their explanation so here you go modern jewellery uh, mo modern jeweller actually said brown Brown is beautiful, uh, but no match for bubbly. So gives you a little bit of a hint about what this actual uh, this, this this article actually reads and you can get this online um, so what are champagne diamonds and it says it tr the truth is in the past natural fancy brown diamonds weren't especially trendy however champagne diamonds are a different thing um, they've gained increase I increasing attention in recent years from collectors and investors um, and it's talking there about sort of, you know, if you think about, you think about the word champagne, we think about luxury, of course, and it's not a brown. We're not talking about a brown diamond here. We're talking about an element of yellow that has also been, um, that has also been mixed in. Um, all natural fancy colored diamonds get their color due to the element's presence in the crystal structure itself, uh, which affects the way of light being absorbed. Champagne diamonds in particular contain nitrogen, which is trapped between the diamond's formations. The more nit nitrogen, the deeper the intensity of the color and vice versa. So what is a champagne color? It's a light brown, typically with a secondary tone of yellow coming through. Um, interestingly, according to uh, the diamonds, uh, two diamonds with a story, champagne diamonds are particularly challenging to polish due to their uh, crystalline structure, abnormal shapes and sometimes etched surfaces. To overcome this obstacle, uh, Rio Tinto's um, Argyle Mine developed special programs in India for successfully polishing champagne diamonds, thus revealing the maximum potential of their beauty. Um, it's explaining, folks, like, the, like I said, the fact that these Champagne diamonds are harder to facet than colourless diamonds or any of your other uh, fancy diamonds because of those um, introductions, if you like, of nitrogen too there as well and the actual difference in the formations. But it talks about how, you know, that, that, that unique way of absorbing light, unlike any other colour of diamond, has, has driven these into sort of a skyrocketing celebrity status, if you like, amongst, amongst collectors and investors out there. So, um, talking about the actual quality, yes, we do grade them. Um, uh, it's basically not in the same way that we would see with our uh, colourless diamonds. You don't have, um, you don't have the sort of um, the D colourless and, for, uh, and, and so forth. This is actually referred to um, in tones like in words like fancy light yellow brown, fancy yellowish brown, or similar phrases that indicate indicate the hue and that intensity. I just want to show you these images just at the bottom here. Um, these images actually show you fancy diamonds. Um, these have all obviously been faceted. A cushion cut you've got here. Um, it shows you the difference that you can get. You can get. These are all as desirable and as valuable as one another. It's all down to the eye of the beholder. If I just scroll down this way, look at that. Just have a little look. We've taken this. This, this article has taken a photograph of quality champagne diamonds natural champagne diamonds and that is what I'm about to bring you jewelry makers it is that quality it is that 
beautiful. Um, something for the collectors, something for the investors. Have you ever seen these in real life? They're amazing, aren't they? Mm. They really are. And that, that description about sort of like the, the, the brands with that that, mm -hmm. that secondary tone of yellow and the gold, is it that's It's perfect, perfect yeah. isn't it? I, um, perfect. Yeah, I hope you don't mind me reading directly from an article, but that, I, like I said, I couldn't have put it better than mm. that. It's, yeah. it, it, it is that brown, but brown doesn't really... It doesn't... It's beautiful, yes, of course it is, but it doesn't describe how amazing mm. a champagne diamond is. Um, there's variations. You, you might have heard of chocolate diamonds. They won't necessarily have the yellow hue coming through um, like champagne diamonds. These are sourced from Australia, so again, any diamond and, uh, diamond enthusiasts out there um, will already know just how regarded uh, Australian diamonds are, famed and celebrated for amazing clarity. Um, I was very lucky to launch a, um, a showcase of natural Australian diamonds some years ago um, not here at jewelry maker um, and it, yeah I mean they were they were all four figure pieces of jewelry that we actually launched this is your opportunity to get something that is heirloom that is legacy that is worth valuing I would say at some point um, at some stage that is definitely deserving of um, being alongside uh, being alongside um, your precious metals like your, your your golds even now I only have a limited quantity of these available um, how would you how would you set this because I'm literally thinking Claire actually taking because for me if you're lucky enough if you're if you're dazzled by what's on your screens right now get it for yourself or, or for maybe you know your daughter or your granddaughter or a, a family member and um, because it's too beautiful to sell it really really is you won't mm -hmm. want to believe me you won't want to um, and I'm thinking about maybe just popping this onto one solid piece of wildfire or fire line or your 0.25 yeah, wire having it like that and having yeah. it exactly like that you yeah. know just across the front of the decolletage but if you are if you if you are you know you, you make jewelry to sell or you want to sort of split the strand to, to give to different you know different people then I would just do it like the necklace I'm wearing, I'd put them on head pins yep. um, and, that, and on jump rings and I'd have it like that. Because, you know, and you could just you could just do one. You could do, do you know, one diamond because of that sparkle. Because of the colour. size, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The brilliance almost multiplies, gives you the illusion mm. of much larger solitaires. Um, but they are big anyway. Going up to three by two millimetres, you're getting one and three quarter carats of natural Australian diamonds. If you were to get, uh, if you are lucky enough to get this, get your certificate of authenticity as well it's an additional 25 pence but it's worthwhile the fact that it will say the country of the origin it will say the fact that these are untreated diamonds which is a real rarity um you know most diamonds out there colorless colored will have undergone some kind of irradiation and that's absolutely fine but it's incredibly exciting and yes it's more valuable when you have naturally colored diamonds like this um i won't have many of them available more considered purchase of course of course is. we're talking heirloom we're talking legacy we're talking about naturally natural champagne diamonds all the way from Australia and you're getting a large carat weight of them as well 249 pounds and 95 pence um, I'm just gonna just turn to, um, to, 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 to Emma and Paul for a second put do you remember guys when we actually did let me just flip back to your names um, when we actually did the launch of natural Australian diamonds can you remember it yeah. the pieces of jewelry just stunning and you can make those jewelry makers have a little look at likes of boodles boodles i mean that's do. the thing isn't it as well that, is, that it's got a drill hole so you yeah know, so that you can you actually, can yeah, make those can pieces make it, yeah. and, and you and rather than actually parting with those four figure sums you know you can do it in a much more affordable way mm. because you have got those skills and you have got those talents and um, i remember watching a documentary um or a program and it was with what's her name emma emma oh gosh actress She's in, she's in Love Actually. What's Thompson. her name? Emma Thompson, that's it. And she's talking about her natural coloured diamond ring that she bought herself from Boodles. Mm -hmm. I won't mention how much it cost. Um, but it's these amazing spectacles. Oh, of course it's going to be more than 249 Of course, 100%. It's got gold, granted. It has got gold. Um, but there's nothing stopping you actually doing that as well. Um, I have got collectors there. Well done. Um, massive congratulations to you. An incredible acquisition. I just feel like I need to do this. Just to show you mm. this, you know. Wow. They're so sparkly, aren't they? Would that look out of place? You know, in Hatton Garden. On Bond Street. It's really flattering as well, isn't it? The colour. It's a very. Um, it's a really elegant yeah. tone, isn't it? 
Champagne is the perfect description mm. for it, isn't it? It's brown with a secondary hue of yellow coming through. Look at that. Amazing. And you could just take three and make a solitaire, uh, make a, a trilogy ring, rather, couldn't yeah, you? Yeah, totally. Yeah. Or little gorgeous clusters. You could sort of set them into your precious metals. We've yeah. had recently, which was really nice to see, the silver clay. Yes, yeah. Yeah, brilliant with Alison. Yeah. yeah. So that would be perfect, wouldn't it? Amazing. Yeah. But um, I have to say, don't heat them because these are natural. And then if you heat them, they're not going to be natural. So you'd you'd make the, the actual ring and then possibly glue them into place if you wanted or secure them some other way. Um, well done. Check out those baskets. It's a limited opportunity. I only have... Um, a few of them within the vault, so if you want to guarantee success, yes, it's more considered. I get that. I totally understand that. You've got a 30-day money-back guarantee. No questions asked. Get them home. Admire them in person. If they're not what your heart's desires, then no problem. Return them back to us, and we shall refund every single penny and pound that you have paid. Um, Okie dokie. Uh, what an opportunity. Who wants more diamonds? Yeah. <sighs> Oh, see, I'd, I'd want to put them together. Oh, no, mm. now you've said it now. Should we oh, twist? I like that. Yeah, do an L twist. Mm. That's wow. That's really sparkly, isn't it? That is amazing. A perfect, beautiful combination. Yeah, and has anyone ever actually seen the Hope Diamond, pictures of the Hope Diamond? I'd imagine so, because you're all jewellery enthusiasts. It is this colour, isn't it? It's that tealy blue. Beautiful teal blue. There are lots of famous blue diamonds, actually, out there. But, yeah, it's this lovely teal blue that you see in the Hope Diamond. Probably one of the most famous diamonds on this planet, I think. Um, so, you're getting two carrots. Again, if I was to wrap it around my finger, look at that. Look how amazing it looks in the ring. Channel set that. Mm. Channel set that using yeah, some one yeah. mil wire. Yeah, the well, sterling silver wire that was in the kit would be really good, wouldn't it? Would be perfect. When it comes to diamonds, we talk about openness of colour as well. Fancy diamonds, rather. We talk about openness of colour. And that is basically how light enters in. Um, <clears throat> You know, it, it doesn't want to be blocked. and You still want to see that presence. You still want to have that brilliance. Um, so, yes, you want the intensity of the saturation, but you still want that wonderful explosion, that performance of light that goes on inside um, high-quality diamonds just like these. They go up to three by two millimeters, and as you said earlier on, being drilled means they're workable for us mm -hmm. here, at, uh, yeah. here at Jewelry Maker. Yeah. Um, anybody that's wondering, what thread would we use with these? Um, you, you want something that's that sort of like the very, very fine beading thread, wouldn't you? Um, I think some the, you know, I don't think it would be the, what's the, you know, the 49. I don't mm -hmm. know whether that would actually go through the, the drill hole. What about wildfire fire line? Yeah, maybe try that. And definitely with the, you know, we got the, we do now the wire wise, we do that, the 0 0.25, don't we? The 0 yep. 0.3 wires. Um, and, and when you're working with them, you know, and you've got a strand like that, go through and, and just check. Cause some of the, some of them will go onto the 0 0.4. So it's always worth sort of like just sitting and taking your time and just seeing what, what goes with, with what wire gauge. Featherweight head pins? Yeah, so you could do um, something like, um, you know, do little clusters of them. So you've yep. got nice movement as well. Yeah. Two carats of diamonds here first. I mean, the fact that very few people on this planet will own a, a carat of diamonds, mm. let alone two carats of blue diamonds. You know, that, that, that is incredibly, incredibly rare. And again, I'm looking at, looking at the bottom of the screen, heat treatment. These haven't been irradiated. So that's amazing. They, they would have come out of the ground um, with that natural blue tone, Gosh. heat treated to intensify that. Fabulous. Graphics, wow, 89 95 So it's a completely different price point um, for two carats. Two carats, absolutely amazing. And again, you can see the rarity of having natural diamonds, naturally natural coloured diamonds, I should say, um, does mean that they generally are a lot more expensive. Um, 249.95 is no reflection of the true value, though. But to get blue diamonds at that kind of price is just crazy, absolutely crazy. And those, you know, different different budgets, isn't it? But those fun, the fancy diamonds work so beautifully together. Yeah. I'm thinking, you know, the the canary um, ones that we've had as well. Yeah. Canary yellows, they, they'd be beautiful with that blue. You can have make a full mm. suite, couldn't you? 
You could make a full suite out of this one strand so yeah, easily. Yeah, definitely, definitely, because it's you know they're, they're precious diamonds. You've got that that intensity of colour. So yeah, you could only like with the with my necklace. You you know it's just one one gemstone, isn't it? That you could you could use. You don't have to use the whole all of it in one. Um, and guess what? We've got black diamonds too. Have you? Uh huh. Um, okay, so I, I've told you this before, but when I first came here at Jewelry Maker, I can remember because we used to have a shop. It was in the old studios. We used to have a shop, and every so often I used to go down and have a little mooch, as you as you do. And I spotted these black diamond studs. I bought them. Paula Bennett bought them, and Hannah bought them as well. We all bought these. They're only teeny little black diamond studs in sterling silver. They cost. I remember it cost me thirty pounds. Bargain, I thought. Absolute bargain. Hmm. Um, and they're nowhere near this size. No way near this size, actually. Gosh, these are, these are they're big, aren't they? Is this the one? That I think it is. Yeah, I think it is those. Look at those. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven huge diamond solitaires. Look at those. It's very familiar. I'd be using this with your precious metal wire, absolutely. Yeah, definitely. So, yeah, those earrings that I bought, a fraction of the size, probably not even half, um, the smaller black diamonds, they cost me £30. Bargain, like I said, bargain, I thought. But the, the, the price that we bring you diamonds at, black diamonds, coloured diamonds, all diamonds, honestly means that my goodness actually maybe I didn't have that much of a good deal um, so beautiful beautiful luster you get that wonderful metallic sheen these are almost rounds though aren't they they're mm. almost faceted yes. rounds which yeah. I don't think we've actually yeah. had before yeah certainly though definitely those uh, two in the center the large ones they really are the average carat weight of a diamond here in the UK as in an engagement ring is apparently three millimeters Sorry, not carrot, sorry, sorry. Measurement is apparently three millimetres. Um, these are each above that. Mm. This right here is your start price. You've got seven sizable solitaires that I think if you did exactly what Claire did um, and literally used, it created a bale, um, you, could make, you could sell them for that price tag instantaneously. Who wouldn't want a, a diamond solitaire necklace? I definitely do. It's some. It's it, it's it's one of those things that is is on my wish list, shall we say? Mm. Just one single diamond on a simple curb chain. Something that I don't think you'd ever, ever, ever need take off. Beautiful. Two and a half carats you're getting here, folks. They'd have to be used as solitaires for me. Because mm, yeah. they're that sizable, yeah. aren't they? Look at those. Or I would, I would put them with the other, the other fancy. For a two point four carat opportunity, that is absolutely amazing. Okay, I'm just just gaining some some perspective here. What have you bought just recently around that price tag? Just have a little think. Have a little think back. I'm not, you know, just think what what have you spent? What have you you paid for that's around that price tag recently? You could have got 2.4 carats. You could have got 2.4 carats of diamonds that is mm. going to last you and, and future and generations a lifetime. Selling on, because I'm thinking, that, so I put mine on, um, it was the, you know, the nine carat gold chain that we had. So yeah. what, I think, what was that, about 25, 29, something like yeah. that? So what's the maths on that then? What's, so if you were going to separate, separate them out. So 99.95 divided by seven. £14.28 oh. per diamond. £14? That massive diamond in the centre is £14. Well, and that one. They're all huge. And then what did you say your chain was? £25? I think it's about £25, pounds, yeah. Yeah, £40 pounds that, that, that amazing piece of jewellery has cost you. And I think you would, you'd, you'd, you'd make your money back and then some straight away. Look at that. Look at that. Have a little, do your research. Have a little look around at the price that black diamonds can be elsewhere. 
Um, make sure that they are like for like quality. Do you notice? Look, look at that blemish free notice how that wonderful surface luster is not actually being hindered in any way shape or form um, make sure they're cut as well as well because these are you know they're almost like faceted rounds I know that our graphics actually say rondelles but for me they're a little mm. bit more curvaceous than... and you, you know how you were saying about um, having sort of like couple jewelry as well so yeah. you could make those quite masculine oh, sorry you? sorry sorry you could um you know if you if you sort of like put them in gents pieces you could do that can we just mm. imagine this as an eternity ring? That's gorgeous, isn't it? Because you've even got the shaping. Mm. With that graduation, yeah. Look how beautiful that is. That's, I mean, if this, if this was finished off with your precious metal and you saw this elsewhere, you'd be talking a lot of money, wouldn't mm. you? I don't want to put a valuation, but you'd be talking a lot, a lot of money. Well done, everybody. Congratulations. Moving on, moving on, moving on. Right, moving on to... Um, we are 35 minutes away from your deal of the day. 35 minutes, and it's a beautiful combination of microfaceting. Um, but let's bring you something completely and utterly different. Ooh, tourmaline. This is a fun strand. Mm. <gasps> We've got bicolor tourmaline in here. Look at that. Rainbow tourmaline, absolutely amazing. 40 carats of natural beauty. The most colorful gemstone on this entire planet. You get, uh, you get yellows, you get oranges, you get pinks, you get blues, you get olive tones, you get browns, you get bicolors. 9.95, oh yes please. It's very fruity, isn't it? Very fruity, I like that. Um, if I was actually watching at home, this would be straight in my basket, Claire. Straight yeah, away. And, and checking out. I do like, I like these the yellowy colors. Yeah, I was going to say the yellows. Yeah. Oh, I like that one there. This one, this one mm. just there. Yeah. That really, be, it is almost amber looking. Oh, speaking of, I wonder, just imagine an amber actually suspended yeah, from that. That's, that's, yeah, that's, that would be fabulous, wouldn't it? Yeah. Those two together. Absolutely gorgeous. $9.95. That's not a tourmaline price tag. There's only 37 of these. Um, we are going to shift up a gear this morning. We are um, picking up the paste. Paste? <laughs> it was going really well as well. <laughs> Just paste in the walls. Just picking up, picking up that paste. <laughs> Sleep deprivation's kicked mm. in. I know. You need to. Pick, oh, you've got tea, haven't you? I was going to uh, say, uh, some uh, coffee. Picking up the pace because I want to. Yeah, I said it right that time. I want to bring you lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of different gemstone deals. Um, so it's going to be on and gone, on and gone, on and gone. What's coming up next? Turquoise. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Um, so I get it. I've been quite high end over the past sort of what hour, what would you say? Um, let's bring you affordability from, 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 from here on in. Yeah? Yeah, well, yeah. Well, they're all affordable, right? you know, if you're actually comparatively speaking, if you think. Um, right then, straight into the turquoise drums. Right, I don't know what that start price is all about. It's almost like somebody forgot... Just went, oh, I'll just repeat that then. For genuine turquoise, these have, uh, RE stands for reconstituted, so it's turquoise, which has been a bit like a shell pearl, has been almost like reformed into um, usually super sizes. 10.95, 16 of them in the vault, that's it. Big Look drill holes, do you Look want me to show yeah. everybody? Look at that, that'd be lovely stretchy bracelets, wouldn't it, with that? Yeah, that absolutely, a bit of sterling silver or, mm. or yellow gold or rose gold in there as well. Yeah. Yeah, perfect for your stretchy bracelets, aren't they? Um, and who doesn't like turquoise? Now, so, you know, this is genuine turquoise. The wonderful thing about reconstituted turquoise is you get an intensity of colour um, and you can get much larger sizes that, that, and, and a much more affordable price tag too. So there's nothing but um, sort of positives. Um, check out, check out, check out if you want to guarantee success. If you had those aquamarines earlier on... Mm. I was thinking as well about maybe knotting them because there's Ooh. a lovely shape and knotting them as a base and with your um, it quite like a substantial piece of jewellery yeah with your with your amber on there because I like the that's I like a that. nice idea oh yeah 
Yeah, I like that combination. Turquoise and amber does mm, work, doesn't it? Really it really does. Yeah. Really works. And yeah. pearls. I love it with pearls yes. too. Yeah. Love that. Twelve of them left. Twelve of them. That's all. Um, yeah, just restrand it, knot it, stretch your bracelet. So you can, this is we're, we're going to talk about sort of stock up your stash, no brainer opportunities. Look at that beautiful waxy luster. It's that luster, that return of light. You can almost actually make out the lights of its surrounding, can't you? Straight down to single figures. Hello, Carol. Hello, Vi uh, Sally, Vivian, Sue. Um, Ali, you're there. Linda, you're there. Gold Goldilocks. And by the way, can I just say, familiar names, all but one person has actually checked out. Familiar names, many of whom actually sell their jewellery. I'm not surprised. I am not surprised that you've all gone um, quite, mm. you know, quite wild for this. It's a mm. big seller. It is a big seller. Um, right then, Amethyst Play wheels love this again i treat i actually treat wheels the same way as i do rounds because i think they really work you know mm. and I, I might be you know the um do you remember early on we had the eye like um like the slices the, the squares yeah that might be quite nice with those Lovely. you got your different different shapes haven't you really beautiful great with the deal of the day as well mm. it's the very definition that amethyst should be that really intense Amethyst purple, that chocolate, post, uh, chocolate box purple. And how impressive that graduation is. I mean, yeah. it's, it's like a continuous rope, isn't it? That how perfectly matched they are. You know, all that work that has gone into that before, you know, you decide to, even if you just did a restrand, just a straightforward yeah. restrand with some of the, the clasps, or I think you've got some magnetic ones, haven't you? And, and there. So you, you I'm know. a fan of that look. It doesn't have to be massively overcomplicated, no, does it? To be all. a beautiful piece. Not um, at all. You saw those lovely butterflies earlier on. Mm. Like, look, how lovely would they be in there? That lovely dove and heart. Yeah. Gorgeous. Mm. If I actually double this over, can you see? Again, the drill hole itself is quite, you know, it's quite sizable there. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but also, we're looking effectively at the narrowest part when we look at it this way. Um, go really, uh, when you actually look at it like so, you've got that really large sort of table of colour just there. Um, yeah, they do go with my nails actually. Yeah, good point. Um, fabulous as well alongside the yellow gold. Um, and just turning silver and your rose gold mm -hmm. as well. Six ninety five jewelry makers. Um, should we do the magnetic class as you as you've mentioned them? Oh, I really what I need to shop today. I need... I've started. So have I. But I can't Trim keep it, I can't yeah. need, keep nagging you and sending you out in the studio. No. So it's different. Roz is Roz is there. She sat down. I can't do it, can I? I wish I could do it. It is a good job I can't, yeah, you're right. Um, so, there's three of them here, so you use them individually, obviously. Um, Gold-plated sterling silver, we only have 11, so it's a last-in-stock opportunity. Now, I'm duty-bound, it's my responsibility to mention that, obviously, if you wear a pacemaker, then do avoid your magnetic clasps, obviously. Um, three pounds and 32 pence. They make wearing jewellery so much easier. Mm. How many of us, like, spend, spend so many minutes struggling, struggling with our clasps, you know, usually when you're in a rush, to get out the door. Yeah, definitely. Literally, these will find themselves. They do the work for yeah. you. And that's the difference, isn't it? Of like, you just sometimes just thinking, oh, yeah, I can't be bothered. I'm can't be bothered. I'm just yeah. going to leave it. In, yeah. Leave it on the side there. Yeah, I do that too. Um, and I've, I've, I've certainly, I've certainly mentioned before that when I first saw magnetic clasps, I was on um, a, a US channel, and we sold them like that. We sold individual magnetic clasps. Um, that little individual magnetic clasp on that US channel was ten dollars for one ten dollars you're getting three for less than ten pounds the final two well done well done deals 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 i like quite rapid auctions yes and me love a ros <laughs> loving the rapid auctions should we do a star buy then is it is it a rapid star buy <laughs> Um, so, ooh, ooh, me, 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 I want it too. What's up next? Okay. 
Um, I think this is the largest one we have mm. in our vault. Um, I own this gemstone, as many of you do, but I don't think many of us will own this size in an individual solitaire, which obviously enhances the rarity. I'm talking about, and you'll guess straight away, a prehistoric miracle of nature, an organic gemstone that forms from fossilised tree resin. These amazing, amazing gemstone uh, uh, cabochons, drops, whatever you, you've, you've got, um, in case wonderful life that happened way back when. This is the largest that we have within our vault currently. Never say never, of course we will endeavour to get more, but um, with the scarcity of your amber, at, at the moment, it's very difficult to hold the tweezers. It's so um, big. Uh, yeah, exactly. Um, it's very, 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 very uh, limited in opportunities. I would love to own this. Um, I bought an amber some time ago from Jewelry Maker, and it, to be, I'll be honest, it was sort of sat um, in my in my bedside cabinet for a long, long time. I didn't, it didn't, I didn't, I looked at it. That's all. But I eventually, um, because as you know, I'm not I'm not great at wire work, so I eventually put pen to paper, and I took it to a friend of mine who was a gem setter, and she actually she actually set it for me. And oh, I love wow. it. Yeah, I absolutely love it. Um, mine is by no means this size at all, but I tell you what, I, I, I love it all the same. <laughs> it's that big, it doesn't <laughs> stay put. There we go. So every single one of those internal inclusions could have been, I don't know, plants, flora, fauna, fur, anything really, life uh, that was present at that given moment in time. It comes from um, a now extinct tree. There was a variety of trees actually that decided on the colour of the amber, by the way. Um, but those trees are now extinct. So it may well be a gemstone that we only have for a limited time, unless of course there are of course brand new discoveries. 29.95 for an amber of this size is absolutely incredible. Um, we very much refer to it as like a, 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 a specialist gemstone now. Do you notice that? It's not actually in very many jewellery establishments anymore um, and if it is it tends to be three figures and then some to be honest a very 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 specialist gemstone scarcity of this since the flooding in 2004 it made a, had a massive impact in terms of the world supply um, and of course the price skyrocketed we're very lucky here at jewelry makers in the sense that we actually have got fantastic relationships with um, with the Baltic region and some of the mine owners over there so therefore we can neg negotiate um, off opposites uh, sorry can negotiate offers just like this um, the biggest that I have seen here at jewelry maker possibly the largest that we'll ever see here at jewelry maker never say never but at 20 $29.95, can you imagine that being suspended around your neckline? Just a simple, simple fastening um, on a 32-inch chain. It's going to look amazing, mm. isn't it? Yeah, it would. I'm thinking, I think, obviously, because it was this morning, but I keep referring everything back to in my head when I see different things, especially something like that, as, as to the, for the DVD this morning. You know, yeah. when you've got... Um, you know, because that would take a lot of the, the really intricate wire The DVD work, we it? filmed yeah, this morning, yeah. yeah, that might be hearts and, 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 and literally be perfect, be an absolutely perfect cabochon for that. I agree. And your wire weaving as well, mm. your seed beading. Yeah. You can seed bead around this too. Um, okay, moving on to... Did you seriously just say Imperial Topaz? Again, again, I'm, I'm sorry, but I've got to say it. Are our strands getting shorter? That's 30 centimetres of a gems, a gems of distinction mm. and a rare gemstone, one of the rarest colour gemstones. Um, so 30 centimetres you're getting here of natural imperial topaz. That's a good ombre strand, isn't it? Amazing ombre strand. It's, it's kind of a like... It's, it's very similar in terms of... Certainly the rarity, um, certainly the value. I kind of liken it to your natural champagne diamonds. Mm, yeah. A yeah. little bit. 14.95 and yet we're going lower. Um, I had, this is not a gemstone that you crash. Imperial topaz is the mm. rarest and often more um, variety of your topaz and it often um, more money goes into the ground than actually comes out of the ground. Um, in a day's mining, 
uh, a previous colleague of mine actually went to a mine over in Brazil and in a day's mining, have a guess how many carrots was unearthed? What do you reckon, Claire? Um, a hundred? You think a hundred carrots was unearthed? Yeah, it's a good guess. It is a good oh, guess. Oh, it's not. Yeah, well, it's not, is it though? Because if that's sixty, you think a hundred carrots was unearthed in a day? Yeah. It's a good guess though. One. Really? <gasps> One carrot was unearthed from the ground from a mine in Brazil. And it's still like, you know, your diesel, all of your machinery, all of your manpower. Yeah. One carrot was unearthed. So, to, like, I actually think we've got our Imperial Topaz pricings massively wrong. I don't know how we're able to offer it to you at these kind of, afford, at these kind of um, prices. But I tell you what, I'm all for amazing deals. Of course I am. But as long as we realise that Imperial Topaz is expensive. Um, again, do your research, have a little look outside of these four walls, and you would see it's, 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 it's like I said, very, very expensive. Um, I've, uh, we've done showcases and... Um, one of my previous employees actually had um, a, a lovely collection of imperial topaz but in their entire years of being a jeweler which was many um, they were only ever able to design to design six different types of imperial topaz pieces so that is how scarce it is they've had more paraba than that they'd have more uh, alexandra more more of all gemstones than imperial topaz in all honesty um so down to the final 30 it is going to be fast and furious we're 20 minutes away um 20 minutes away from your deal of the day Ooh. Mm. Ooh. with the uh with the brown pearls as well from earlier that'd yes be nice. that's a lovely combination mm. Tiger's Eye with Imperial Topaz. Wow, wee. that is quite something, isn't it? Um, these are your irregular drops, and they are top drilled. 75 carats you're actually getting here with the chatoyancy. Just look at these ones up here as the light hits. Uh, beautiful, beautiful chatoyancy. What? 3.95? I think at that price, then, I would, I'd multi-buy and remove the spacers, and then so they're all really grouped and clustered together. Ooh. A word. Why not at that price? Well, yeah. It's not like you have to think. Oh, mm. hang on a minute. I've got to be. I've got to be careful with my carrots. <laughs> at three ninety-five. You know, go all in. Mm. Go absolutely crazy. Team it alongside your magnetic class that you had earlier on. How lovely yeah. would this be? Is like a really uh, wonderful sort of tessellating wrist line piece. Yeah, yeah. See, I think that's what I'm seeing. You know, if you, so if you, you know, if you twisted it, you'd do have that. Do you want me to do the yes. twist? Yes, I want you to do the L twist, yeah. please. No problem. Yeah. Kind of like that, but without the spacers. Yeah, or you could use the deal of the day um, for spacers, couldn't you? Oh, lovely idea, a bit of lemon quartz and beautiful garnet, micro-faceted, yeah, really fabulous, fabulous idea. And affordable jewellery makers, anybody that's a fan of micro-faceted gemstones, seed beading, channel setting, stay tuned. You can make your tassels out of these. Mm -hmm. Isn't it, you can you can you can do those tassels. You can actually uh, um, just pop them on little on little jump rings if you like, and just suspend them just like yeah, so. Yeah, yeah. Look, with your um on your with your wire, just do little wraps around the top. Yeah, perfect. Absolutely perfect. Well done. Hello, Manny. Hello to you, uh, uh, Midlothian, Alison, Jane, Vivian, Catherine, Deborah. You're there as well. Um, lots of you still dialing through. I can see you. Hello. 32 centimetres. Oh, come here. There we go. 32 centimetres. So again, it's a long strand. I do sound like I'm ranting a little bit. I'll stop now. I'm just saying that our strands are not getting shorter. If anything, I think they're getting longer. Um, I've, been using, I've been using this with the amber that we had as well. Yes, yeah. It'd be nice warm tones, wouldn't mm, it? Beautiful. Yeah. Absolutely beautiful. Um, okay, moving on to... I still have got a Charite capuchon. Now, hang on a minute, Roz. Can you tell me your intentions? Honourable, she says. Mm. Honourable intentions towards the Charite. A one locational gemstone from Russia. You get these really beautiful markings and patterns, and it's like a, a lavender, a fusion of lavender, pinks, and blues, if you like. 
Um, yeah, the more purple, the more valuable, basically. Um, you can see these kind of that silky light reflection that comes from these feather-like inclusions that are within the gemstone. It is an opaque gemstone, so you're not looking for clarity, um, transparency or diaphanity. It's all about those wonderful, almost like Monet brush strokes. Um, one locational, one of the few one locational gemstones out there, and you're getting five carats. Um, of this beautiful gemstone. Now, I, I, I let's let's see. <gasps> there is Ooh. nothing. Zero. Zip. Nada. Nothing honourable about that price tag, Ros. That would be great. Uh, honourable to you at home, obviously. For the if you got the prong setting. Uh, if you got the prong setting DVD. Yeah, because it's perfect size, isn't it? For, if um, you get the DVD that we filmed this morning. Yeah. Yeah, but that's perfect ring size, isn't it? So Look at that. Beautifully. I'm not surprised that you're going crazy, wild in the aisles for it. I would too. Look at, have you ever seen Charite at that kind of price tag before? No, nor me. 15 of them left. They're not hanging around though, are they? Nine in baskets, so you're going to, it's pointless leaving them there. It really is. I think most people, I think most people, Um, I think most people realise that it's not a price tag that, that, that we ordinarily see. Um, massively over-allocated, massively. Wendy, Vivian, Teresa, Lorraine, Christine, Sarah. Lots of you getting twos, threes, fours of them. Don't blame you. Um, Okie dokie, we have got... Um, we have got an amazing chrome dioxide opportunity coming your way, um, plus more incredible deals. Um, we're going to go straight into it as a star buy. I'm not allowed to say it, but can you? It's just another rant now. Yeah. That's the length of the strand. Yeah. Seriously. For chrome dioxide. Um, wait a minute. I just want to do this. Just. Yeah. I, I, and I know I've gone on about it, but I think it's really important. Chrome dioxide, you would put into, I think you'd all agree, the same caliber as all of our gems of distinction strands. So, you, you know, your Burmese sapphires, all of those, your, your Burmese rubies, all of those. You, and you'd expect a shorter strand. That's because it is that a little bit more affordable. So, um, what did they used to be? What was it like 15 centimeters? A gems yeah, distinction yeah. strand? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. So, it would have been that. Yeah? That's what it would have been. You're getting, and I'm going to measure this for you. From not from tassel to tassel, from gemstone to gemstone, 41 centimeters here. It goes off the ruler in actual fact. Just saying. Just saying. These are incredible, aren't they? Yeah, exactly. Large, mm. large chrome dioxides, completely and utterly natural. Chrome dioxide, uh, I should say, dioxide falls all, uh, forms all the way around the world. Chrome dioxide is specifically from Russia. Um, since uh, um, a gem trade fair that happened in Tucson, Arizona, it massively, massively gained the status um, because it was likened to the beauty of your Zavarite garnet. Um, since then, there's a, a lot of concern about the mining of this gemstone. Um, we don't, I can't confirm or deny, we don't know if it's still in production um, because, to be honest, we actually can't get any, any response. Um, and that's not just us, that's traders globally all around the world. Um, so, often referred to as the million dollar emerald because of its high refraction and that natural colour. Often it suffers with something that we actually call... Um, colour extinction and that basically is where um, at sort of dark, dark intense areas. You're not just getting this 41 centimetre strand though of chrome dioxide. 41. Mm. Perhaps we need to start putting that actually on the graphics itself just to indicate the length. Um, you're also getting all of this amazing sterling silver um, and it comes in 925 bolt ring class, 6 millimetres. You get a pack of 10 of those. You get 925 heart head pins, um, a pack of 1050 mil and 1040 mil. 
just imagine one of these on your chrome dioxide. Look how pretty they are. Ignore the start price. We know it's strange, we know it's bizarre. 41 centimetres you're getting. Mm. That's almost of, of, half a metre of chrome dioxide. Just for us. big, they're big. Big they're chrome big, dioxide. Yeah, big ovals as well. Yeah, not small. Not small. The actual sizes of them go up to nine by six mm. millimetres. You try and find another jeweller. I'm not saying it's not possible, but you try and find another jeweller that will be able to bring you that scale solitaires. And then obviously recognise that these are you're getting multiples. In fact, I've got to count them for you. I've got to, because these are standalone solitary rings, if you like. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 48, 50, 52, 54, 56. 56 solitaires. I own a chrome dioxide piece of jewellery. It's no way near that size. No way near. That's working out how much? 178. You know, even if you just forget all of the silver editions, I can't believe mm. I'm saying that, but you know, the 20 heart head pins and the 10 Boltwing class, even if you did that um, and thought about this 41 centimeter chrome diopside strand opportunity, surely at 99.95, pound 78 pence each, we all realise that that's incredibly, incredibly affordable. And I think, you know, I'm thinking, it makes me think of, you know, Jan, uh, guest designer yep. Jan, who sells her pearl jewellery. You know, you have one of those, one of those um, chrome diopside in amongst some of the pearl strands that we've, that we've done because you've got that si wonderful size of the gemstone, that mm -hmm. wonderful, you know, vivid colour, and that you're introducing, you know, chrome diopside into your, into your jewellery pieces. It's Which not many jewellers exactly. will have. Yeah. Not many will have. Um, the, uh, much like I said about Larimar, we'll have like literally a couple of strands in our, di in, in, in our vault at any one time. It's so, so, mm. so scarce. And it's always one of those gemstones that's on our buying team's radar, much like, much, much like diamonds, you know, um, mm. sorry, much like diamonds and tanzanite, much like, you know, um, at the moment, I'm going to say Ethiopian opal is very difficult to get hold of, I hear. Um, I could go on. Imperial topaz, as we actually brought that today, very, very, very difficult to get hold of. Paraba, Paparaccia, all of those ones. It's in that same league. Barbara, you've done it. Wendy, you've done it. Jane, you're very close to getting yours. Um, I've also got collectors in London. I've got anonymous collectors. Welcome. Um, and uh, Wendy, thank you for messaging in. Um, so I'm so, so pleased. I'm so, so, so pleased. Um, that you actually managed to get hold of yours. It's a limited opportunity. You get all of this beautiful sterling silver as well. Don't forget. Don't forget all of that sterling silver. So you could just do wonderful charms, couldn't you? So time-wise, not you know, not you wouldn't have to spend a long time. Just put one one of your chrome dark side on a head pin uh, onto the. Um, onto the bolt ring clasp and then attach that to anything else you know just one one lovely gemstone and do your research on it too mm. it's only mined or rather it was only mined for three months of the year when it was guaranteed still in production it was only ever mined during the summer months and that's because the location was so um, extreme in terms of the climate it was so 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 cold the machinery literally wouldn't penetrate the actual ground um, so three months of the year every year if you imagine working in those conditions you know just the, the, the temperatures um, the, uh, and the fact that nothing is, is is guaranteed showing up to work you're not guaranteed to unearth a gemstone when it comes to mother nature um, but every year there was a massive decline from from like 2009 10 11 12 huge decline in in miners returning to that location so that might have been an indication of why the mine is closed i can't confirm that's true um, but the other speculation is maybe that the chrome dioxide mine has been purchased and bought by an individual collector a lover of gemstones which is wholly possible as well um, again lots of you coming through um well done to you vivian well done to you i've got west midlands there as well barbara congratulations i'm going to move on we're 10 minutes away from your dealer the day um, because our oh, box clasp do you love a box clasp I think I think they are one of the most luxurious clasps would mm, you agree yeah definitely. Um, because we've we've touched on the fact that it's engineering with certain mm. with jewelry and it's, uh, it's like the most solid as well isn't it you yeah you've got the most um, most vintage too yeah 
Lots of vintage jewellers use it. So let me just show you like this initially. So imagine a door, a wedge. And then if I hold the actual flower clasp up, you can see. Beautiful, <clears throat> what we call a rubbed over setting um, or a bezel set um, of amethyst. All of that sterling silver, look at that. A lot of sterling silver. I'm holding on to the fixed loop. And obviously that fits in and it clicks into place through the actual through the actual hole. When I first saw this, I thought it was a charm. I actually thought that was a charm. It was pretty enough, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. You've got just shy of half a carat, 19 by 12 millimetres in its size. Um, beautifully gem set and there's the 925 stamp on the actual reverse. Um, we've been talking about sort of luxury pieces today. Mm. This kind of clasp would actually give me the peace of mind, I suppose. Yes, yeah. And, and I think I would put it with the, you know, the strand of amethyst that you had? Yeah. Um, because if you're going to do, say, a bracelet, I mean, they move around, don't they, all the time? So that may sort of fall to the front and it becomes the, the, the focus of the oh, That's going to be beautiful, isn't it? Yeah, so really beautiful. Nice. Twelve ninety five. We've got just shy of three grams of sterling silver here. Um, literally, it clicks into place. I wonder if I can do it whilst it being on the tweezers. So there we go. Clicks into place just like that. And that is your secure box clasp. We've, we, we've had them before, but we very rarely actually have them in actual fact. Um, I'm looking mm. across at your next kit, Claire. Perfect. Mm, it would go re yeah, really well with that. Perfect really with your next well. kit. Any of your, um, your pearls, if you really want to go out and sort of multi-layered necklaces or any gemstone for that matter, this would be perfect for that. We don't see your box clasp very frequently. We certainly don't see them at 12.95. I was expecting it to be probably, probably double that. Actually. Yeah, with such a large gemstone as yeah. well. So, yeah. Yeah. Amazing. Well done. Okie dokie. It's like a maple leaf. Cubic zirconia. Sterling silver. I like the curve to it. I think I would, I would have it the other way. Like that. No, I didn't like it. The other, like, uh, <laughs> <laughs> like that. Yeah. All right. Like All that. Right. Just like a that. bit. Just a bit tired. <laughs> oh, I see what you mean. Like that. So it'd have that nice curve. So it's coming down to a point. I might have something dangling off the, off that bottom connector, and then a, and then a, a jump ring bail here. Do you know what I would do? And that's a lovely pendant. That's what a really do? lovely pendant. I would get a load of sterling silver beads. Yeah. And I would turn that into a stretchy bracelet. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah. Or stretchy necklace. I like the idea of that. Yeah. Or maybe that could be the top of a tassel. Or a pair of earrings. Can be anything. anything. And absolutely anything. With that curve. Look, yeah, it'd look. be nice in, that, in one of the sliders. Isn't it's it? going to fit. Mm. Or a slider bracelet. Yes. Love it, absolutely love that idea. Ten ninety five only. Gorgeous cubic zirconia here, um, with your with your with, with your sterling silver. Sorry, I couldn't get my words out there for a second. Um, <laughs> it's a twenty three by twenty five millimeter opportunity. How easy would it be to turn these into it, like earrings, etc.? Well, really easy. You just open and close your, um, your your shepherd's hook here, wouldn't you? At yeah. The top. And then it's up to you whether you, because um, that, that's quite a discreet, isn't it? That little, I've said discreet so many times today. I'm really sorry. Um, so you could, you could hang something or, or not. Yeah. A little pearl. I'll, try, I'll have subtle next time. A chrome diopside. Yes. Or if yeah. you want to, just remove, just remove it all together. In fact, the chrome diopside would look fabulous, wouldn't it? Deal of the day would be. Deal yeah. of the day. Perfect. Okay, moving on to. This is beautiful. Mm. I love this cut of gemstone. Oh, yeah. It's an emerald cut. Cubic zirconia is faster in the same way that diamonds are, you know. Yes, it's a laboratory created gemstone. It's a crystal, it still grows. Um, that's faceted in that same way. Look at that. Ray Art Deco piece. Mm. Beautiful. It's basically um, a way of actually owning a decolourless diamond 
you know, with exceptional clarity at a more affordable price. Because you, again, we've got to remember that yes, it would be amazing if we could all if we could all spoil ourselves with decolourless diamonds. Wouldn't it be fabulous? Mm. However, not everybody has that budget. No, um, so, we'd have to walk around, wouldn't we, with bodyguards? And yeah. Absolutely. Like oh, I, I, gosh, I couldn't even put a price tag on this. Um, look at that. Beautiful fasting. $9.95. Just turn it over so you can see the amount of sterling silver. You've got that lovely, um, you've got that lovely pavilion there and all that sterling silver that's invested in the back. I don't know why, but I keep, I keep thinking about possibly removing that loop mm. and maybe gluing this onto a cabochon. Oh, that'd be a different look. Ah. Is that an approving ooh? I'm, I don't I, know. I have to say I'm not convinced. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, next time, <laughs> just, just a little point to improve, to be a little bit more convincing there. <laughs> it wasn't what I was expecting you to say. No? No, but, yeah. That's you twice know. you've done that today. <laughs> twice. What you... cabochon would you have? Don't, don't, don't try and soften that blow. <laughs> Sugar coat it now. You've already I'm rubbished. sorry. No, it's fine. It's fine. I'll let you off. It's tired. We're tired. Sorry. It's fine. I know you would. Don't. Come on then. <laughs> Claire, guest designer. <laughs> what would you do with it? Uh, yes. How about with your deal of the yes. day? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's fine. I'm not going to make any suggestions anymore. You oh, can give them no. all. Fine. <laughs> I'm only joking with friends really look at that yeah they'd be beautiful suspended wouldn't they absolutely amazing congratulations everybody do stay where you are your deal of the day is a few moments away um micro faceted beauty more incredible incredible kits and jewelry from the wonderful claire oh and, and i love every single one of those pieces i keep looking across at it claire i've got to be honest it's all the wonderful colors isn't it it is beautiful um yeah stay tuned 12 o'clock kit is absolutely amazing deal of the day though up after this Owning a strand of genuine gemstones is always exciting, but being able to use it in your handcrafted jewellery, then passing it on to its new owner with proof of its authenticity is even more incredible. Why not add one of our printed authenticity cards to your order and share that same feeling with your customers? You can also access online authenticity certificates through items you have previously ordered by looking at your order history on your account details. The certificate gives you valuable information about your purchase and is your guarantee of quality and peace of mind from Jewelry Maker. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Jewelry Makers, we have some important news to tell you about. On Tuesday the 26th of June, Jewelry Maker is moving home on Freeview to Channel 74. Don't forget that you might need to retune your Freeview box. This should only take a few minutes. So, from the 26th of June, you'll find Jewelry Maker on Freeview, Channel 74. Our brand new Get Started with Jewelry Maker page has been created to provide help and guidance for jewelry making newbies. If you need design suggestions, hints and tips, or help with perfecting your jewelry designs, we're here to help. Head over to facebook.com slash getstartedwithjm where our talented in-house designers are happy to answer your jewelry making questions, offer inspiration, and get you started in your jewelry making journey. Jewelry Maker. Create. Wear. Share. Did you know that when you book a Jewelry Maker workshop, you're given exclusive access to our Jewelry Maker shop? You can browse through special items and offers, be privy to selected discounts and deals that you can't get at any other time. Shop whilst you learn and grab yourself some amazing offers. For more information on workshops and available dates, contact our call centre.
Buying with Jewelry Maker online couldn't be easier. Just head over to our website, jewelrymaker.com, and click on the register link. Simply fill in the required fields and you can shop 24-7. You'll also be privy to a faster checkout and personalized offers. Jewelry Maker, your one-stop shop for all your jewelry making needs. It's easy to stay in touch with Jewelry Maker. You can like our Facebook page and join a community of over 65,000 people. You can follow us on Twitter and tweet us your messages and opinions, send photos of your designs and enter our Wall of Fame competition. Or if you need any help or advice, you can email our friendly help team. Make sure to get involved and stay up to date with Jewelry Maker. Getting started with Jewelry Maker couldn't be easier. When you spend with us £4.95, you will get a free welcome pack. That welcome pack will give you pretty much everything you need to get started. From a manual, which will help you to familiarise yourself with all of the items that you're going to be creating and all of the products that you need, including tools and findings and threads. You'll also get a DVD and step-by-step -step project cards. These cards and the DVD will give you the chance to be able to create a wonderful arrangement of different items of jewellery. Plus, you'll also get a free three pack of tools. These will be everything you need to get started. So, getting started with the Jewellery Maker couldn't be easier. So why not give it a go today? Jewellery Maker, your one-stop shop for all your jewellery making needs. Here at Jewellery Maker, we're always making improvements to give you a better shopping experience. We've recently upgraded our website to make it more user-friendly and easier to navigate around. We now have the Guest Checkout function, which allows customers to check out quickly without creating an account. Our homepage now informs you with what's currently live on the show, recently aired items and today's deal of the day. We've improved our website navigation and added new categories to help customers quickly find the products they want. Our online range is growing fast with over 7,000 products available for you to purchase. And don't miss out on hundreds of brand new clearance lines with more added every week. Happy shopping with Jewelry Maker. Create, wear, share. Okie dokie, are you ready for your deal of the day? This, I, 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 in all honesty, I think the popularity of microfaceted gemstones has skyrocketed um, because, small but mighty, I say that every single time, but just delicate little pieces built up, whether they be around the neckline, whether they be in the ear, whether they be um, on the wrist, it just looks amazing. So much so that it's actually prompted Claire to do a whole workshop mm. for stacker style. Yeah. I mean, you wear your stacker bracelets all the time, don't you? I do, I do. Um, but there's nothing stopping you doing that with your, um, you know, with your gemstones. It's everywhere. If you go into the local Swarovski shop, which I know is, is, is crystal, not gemstones, but um, if you go into there, one of the things that they've, they launched, I think around Christmas time, was um, a style of bracelet stroke necklace. The idea is that you buy lengths like this. And I think it was the really beautiful um, Naomi Campbell that was on the campaign. Um, but you buy lengths like this. And <clears throat> it's a bracelet length. But you can connect them all together if you wanted to wrap it round and round and round, and likewise with your necklace. That's, that's the wonderful thing about sort of smaller, finer, faceted gemstones. Because yes, they're tiny, yes, they're dainty, they're petite, but they can really create a really big design. Um, <clears throat> again, what we're taking this deal of the day, and I have got a massive quantity, which is really exciting. I've got over 500 of these, but I need every single one of them. Um, 
is I, I, if you actually break it down, divide it to these two strands and work out exactly what they're working out at each, it's crazy. They're two millimetre rounds. Um, the amount of time that goes into fasting just one of these absolutely beautiful, absolutely beautiful gemstones um, just still absolutely amazes me. Now, you're getting garnet here and also lemon quartz. So it's almost like a, a really beautiful gold alongside the intensity of your wonderful almost like pomegranate red mm, pomegranate red straight yeah. away now if you're wondering why um our lovely claire is a bit quiet i know it's unusual it is unusual um it's because we've got a busy making really beautiful jewelry don't mind do you claire not at all it's lovely to work with so we were like just you know just make some simple stack of bracelets mm show everybody how easy it's to work with and how beautiful the results can actually be and also how much you can get out of this one day of the day don't expect people to just be getting the one um, um can i just give you a little bit of a heads up as well if you're waiting for um the actual uh, uh, sort of price to come on your screen that's absolutely fine however um, I reckon that probably a good third of the stock will have been allocated by then. It is affordable. Trust me. This is one of the most affordable deal of the days that I have actually seen in months. Um, and the graphics are live now. That right there is our start price. So there we go. We're not stopping. Look at that. So beautiful. Start price. Not stopping there. I've got over 500 of these available. It's a definite, definite stash essential. It's something that without doubt you can just use as they are, but use in shibori, use in your channel setting, use in your, your beading, your seed beading, your wire work, absolutely everything, Claire. Would you agree? Yeah, totally. And, and they're such, um, such a workable strand as well being really beautiful but the drill hole in them is is really deceptive compared to the actual size of the how delicate the actual you mm -hmm. know the, the the bead is itself so um you know you can do an awful lot an awful lot with them so that was going to be my next question so um a featherweight head pins you're using yeah. just now yeah um you've also just fed what's this through so that's just on the on the the, the temporary strand that it's on okay. just for speed but that's you can standard, use you like, can use our beading thread. threads can't yeah. you let me just show everybody that bracelet already claire's already made this look how beautiful that is how much do you think that would be elsewhere a lot it would be you know you'd be talking what do you reckon you, 20, 30 pounds at least to wear something like that. A genuine gemstone opportunity. So just from one design and yet you've got oodles left over, you're already in profit. Um, it, it's, it's already getting quite quite busy on the web and on the phone lines thank you for your trust we're not stopping there your deal of the day opportunity with all of that fire with all of that saturation with all of that amazing intricacy of cutting is today at just 12.95 wow. lo i love a micro faceted gemstone yeah i mean i'm gonna i'm just gonna pop these on i'll try and speed up and so you that's can, pretty so you can see how this technique so that's three on there I just take that. I'm just going to finish that off, but then you can see. And so these are in, you know, this these little details are in lots and lots of jewellery. So I'm just going to snip that off. So I've done like two two little um, two little wrap loops, and then the third on like a. Um, can you see? So you get that in in lots of lots of jewellery. So yeah, on the on the bottom of the leaves that you did. So you pop the two together. I've just had an idea Have that you? hopefully, hopefully you'll like. <laughs> well, let's hear it. Glass push and everything. Um, how about, I mean, it would take time. It would take time. But I, I'm actually quite nervous. It's like telling a teacher about the answer. So how about if mm -hmm. you did lots of those little, little wrap loops mm -hmm. and created a really beautiful, delicate bubble style bracelet? I like that. Good. Oh. I like it. Mm. Think like of all that. of that lovely sparkle, thank goodness. I feel like I can breathe now. Check out those baskets. Good luck, Shirley, Isabel, Donna, Gussie, Ella, Jill, Hertfordshire, Sharon, uh, Debbie, Kent, Margaret, Wiltshire, uh, Midlothian. You do really like it, don't you? Do you like I do. Idea? I love that idea. That's in amongst maybe some pearls. Are yes. you going to do it now? Wonderful. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Do 
Yeah, I'd love to wear yeah. that. By the way, can I just say, just just say it's our wedding anniversary tomorrow, so it'd be Is really it? nice, you know, to have some garnet and quartz <laughs> to wear. You know. <laughs> <laughs> Second wedding anniversary. <laughs> I know, technically speaking, that's not, not got anything to do with garnet and quartz, but it just would be lovely. <laughs> really lovely. Um, that's working out at £6.50 per strand. £6.50 per strand. Um, in terms of their actual length, I'll give them again a measure for you so you can actually work out um, how much you're getting effectively. Uh, uh, not only in the carrot weight, sorry, I've just wrapped those together there. Hang on a second, not only um, in the carrot weight, but also in terms of individual gemstones. So, um, in your garnet, you are getting from gemstone to gemstone 32 centimeters. You might get slightly more, nevertheless. Um, in your lovely lemon quartz, you're getting again 32 centimeters. 32 centimeters of all that micro faceting. That's a lot of work. I can't even comprehend. How, how how somebody goes about cutting a two mil gemstone? Can you? No, it's um, it is. You know when we see like the shapes of the gemstones, yeah. you've got a thing, haven't you? Like a, be a little bit in awe of all the skill that has gone into it. And then and we the bring it at six pound yeah. fifty. Six pound fifty, effectively. Mm. That's what these are. Oh, that looks nice. That's lovely. I know. You could get a cabochon now, oh. couldn't you? And you could stick that Ooh. In, the, in the middle. Yes. <laughs> I do like that idea. <laughs> Just pop a little bit wire through the centre. <laughs> that Te was your idea. I, I, was, uh, I was doing your idea. Te <laughs> God. So you mean, you mean put a halo around it rather than just stick it in the middle? Um, yeah, you could do, yeah. Yeah. Oh, 800, 6, 4, 6, 5, all the W's at jewelrymaker.com. Well done. Um, lovely having your company. Hello to you, Nicole in Florida. Hello to you, Ros Rosalind, Surrey. Ella, you've done it. Helen, you're very close. Juliet, well done. Mari in Dumfries and Galloway. Lots of multi buying. And I don't blame you, stock up your stash. The reality is micro faceting. Normally we pay about $14.95 for a strand of this length. Mm. I've got within my very, uh, within my stash, I know, I was literally, I was literally working with it, no, not last night, was it last night? No, night before, um, and microfaceted spinel, so again, desirable yeah, gemstone, which is one of the most like popular these. strands, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I yeah. paid fourteen ninety five for it, it's the same length as what's on your screens right now, so this is a deal of the day price. Deal of the day price. You're basically getting a discount already on one strand and you're getting another mm. one free. So, amazing. You come back to us in Christmas. And, and by the way, it's not us elevating our price tags. It might be the fact that we have to pay more for your garnets around the festivities, you know. Um, you, you come back to us in, in, in maybe a few months' time and see how much our garnet is then. If it's a brand new opportunity just like this, it's probably going to be more than what's on your screens right now. So, stock up your stash. Christmas isn't that far away. Did I say 21 weeks? Is 21 it? weeks. And I was thinking as well, you know, with um, uh, guest designer Jan's, or the channel setting, the beautiful mm. channel setting that she does, that would be, they'd be perfect for that. Perfect. Look at that. I haven't actually got any jump rings, so I'm just using all our bolt ring clasps. Look how beautiful that is. Okay, that's lovely. That's so gorgeous. Ah, oh, just an idea. You could have one per child. Yeah, kind of like a you charm could. bracelet, yeah. but with yeah. gemstones. Or, or per pet. Per pet. Per pet. Yeah. I like that idea. You could pop their uh, garnet is a birthstone, of yes, course, my as birthstone. well. Is it? You're yeah. a January baby. Yeah. yeah. Lovely. Well, then you need to make yourself one of these little bracelets, yes. don't you? Yeah. You really do. Would you? You could swap it round, though, couldn't you? You could have do, you could have garnet as the prominent colour, and then actually have the lemon quartz mm. as the little tassels. Well, it goes really, really well, really well. That's absolutely beautiful. Well done. Um, you've popped your little tassel there as well. You like a tassel? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Making full use, full use of the strand itself. Look at that. I mean, again, if you saw that in, tassels are really, really in. Sleep deprivation has kicked in. 
Um, yes. No, if you saw that in, 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 a, in a high-end jewellers, you'd be talking hundreds, wouldn't you? For any gemstone bracelet, surely. Mm. Uh, incredible. Now, we had just over 500 of these. Uh, well over half the stock has gone, so make sure you check out those baskets. Incredible. I love it. So there we are. You're getting four tassels for that. Very, 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 um... Ice cream colours. Yes. Mm. I'm so glad. That's the kind of, that's kind of what I was actually looking for. It looks, oh, like, it looks like Battenberg. Yeah. Oh, okay. oh, oh, yes. Oh, right. Can I ask a, a, a very serious question? Can I ask a serious question? Is, uh, is anyone else here capable of eating a single slice of Battenberg? Or do you have to eat the whole thing? Um, you can eat a single slice. What, the whole cake? <laughs> I think it looks like, I think it looks prettier than it tastes. Sorry, I just have to eat the whole cake. Would you eat the whole cake? Yeah. You can get little ones, can't you? Yeah, no. No. So like a whole... <laughs> Please. Why do you... Do you even like... Do you just... I mean, I'm not saying I do this regularly, but... Do you, you know, still slice I, I, it? Though? I have eaten a whole Battenberg cake before. In one go. <gasps> do you go. Just... Do no, you I do slice it? it. I do slice Why it. Why do you bother slicing? Because you know, you just like. I don't set out intentionally to eat the whole cake. <laughs> Your little finger. It's just one of those. You're like, oh, I'll have some more. Oh. Mm. Mm. Yeah, there really is a few things that you just. I had a whole I can't layer stop of myself. Um, mini rolls yesterday. You ate a whole layer of mini rolls. Yeah. See, there we go. Mm. You were judging me then, weren't you? You were judging me with my Battenberg, but yeah, mm. it was you with the mini rolls. It was yesterday, yeah. There we go. Totally. Mm. Apparently, it's Ros it would be like a whole bag of crisps. We've all got a downfall, mm. haven't we? Yeah, mm. absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Share bags. <laughs> Nobody's sharing those. <laughs> Nobody. Nobody. It's like, it's like... Yeah, it's like those chocolate-coated peanuts, you know the ones? Oh. You get in the bowl. No, I'm not sharing them with anyone. No way. Mm. Anyway, um, well done. Check out those baskets, Vivian, Helen, Rosalind, Laura, Nicole. Um, well done to Lynette, Carol, Jane. Still people dialing through. We've got people multi-buying and stocking up your stash. And I think that's, you know, sensible, really, because... You, you're going to use garnet. You always will use garnet, won't you? Um, your little two millimetre faceted beads, look at that. Beautiful amounts of lustre, wonderful amounts of brilliance. Pop those as, as, as very, very, very high end spaces in between your gemstones. Yeah, yeah. Beautiful. Or just or take, take 12, I think it's 12, isn't it? And do your beady bead because you've yeah. got, um, you've just had one on the cord that you've got. Love it, that. love it. Mm. Okay, do you want to see a strand that I've been eyeing up all morning? All morning, I love it, absolutely love this. Seriously, Aww, that's beautiful, isn't, isn't it? it? Again, proper gems of distinction mm. strand here. Length you're getting clusters of three. They're little pen. They're little uh, uh, sweets of jewellery, aren't they? In terms of the clusters, it's your sky blue topaz. Uh, topaz is one of the gemstones that has the most amazing clarity, and that's why you can. Do you notice how the light is hitting each of these? Just, uh, just, just, just have a look at one if you like. And notice how the light almost pools in one area. You see that the light almost pooling. It's very, it's very grace. It's very uh, glacial, isn't it? Um, that's how wonderful briolettes are. They facet, they're faceted 360 degrees all the way around in this kind of teardrop-like shape. Um, made probably made most popular, I think, in. Um, in, in the Victorian era, but has never deterred from that. So um, we see it a lot in actually uh, lots of chandelier style earrings, mm. lots of drop style yeah. earrings. How easy is it to work with these, Claire? Really easy. I know I've, I've have done um, demos of how to, um, how to wrap, uh, do your wire work with them um, through the drill hole. So it'd be really nice with the, um, the rose gold, you know, the filled wire that we had. Yeah. It'd be good for that. Oh, that would be really lovely, actually. I like the idea mm. of that. I, they deserve your high end, that high end precious metals, don't they? Without doubt. Really do. Your sterling silver, your rose golds, your yellow golds, um, all of the above. Um, attach them to your little, uh, your sterling silver shepherd hooks. 
And you yeah, know, like, if you've got the um, the chrome dark side in the heart <gasps> with the hearts on, they'd be nice with those. Oh, really amazing, lovely. amazing. Let me just count them for you. So hold, uh, uh, I'll pop the strand. Oh, look at that. It's almost reflecting the colour. It's really lovely how it is like little droplets, isn't it? 18, 21, 21, You've got 33 individual standalone solitaires there. And they are all sizable aren't they up to 11 by 6 millimeter that's working out at one pounds 51 each or oh, you like you know how you were saying it was sets of jewelry because if that could be like your something blue couldn't it for your yeah. bridal so you'd have like that be each you know how many sets is that 11 yeah 11 brides was it i don't know i just said yes then two four <laughs> six. yes yeah. Sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. I literally just realised I did just say yeah. Yes. And didn't even think about what you said. Sorry. Yeah, there is 11 sets there. Is. Um, a friend of mine actually is just um, for, for, for her um, little girl's birthday. Um, the daddy actually bought the mum a present and it's her daughter's birthstone, which was, which was topaz. And I thought, how thoughtful. Um, you could bet your bottom, bottom dollar that he would have paid a lot more than what's on your screens right now. Um, hello to you, Nicola, saying, um, what's that reseal tags on share bags what are they for I know. yeah that's true I mean who's yeah. resealing that it doesn't happen does it it doesn't happen it's mm. you know basically you know they're like oh for sharing no that's not it's just like that's just like a proper portion isn't it as opposed mm. to just getting <laughs> As opposed to going back into the kitchen to get a, like a second bag. <laughs> Just saying. Yes! When you go out for meals and some of your <clears throat> friends goes, oh, I'll just have a starter. Why? Why? Mm. That's okay, as long as then they don't try and have a little bit. Oh, yeah. Of yours? <clears throat> yeah. Can you imagine? <laughs> no, I wouldn't. <laughs> oh dear. Um, although, yeah, no, I don't. I don't pinch people's food off their plate. <clears throat> don't do that. I don't do that. No, it's it's it's. it's <laughs> Paul's not believing me. <laughs> I agree. What's the reseal for? Pointless. Yeah, really pointless. Point. And in fact, that's a good text topic, isn't it? What things do you think we should are a bit pointless in life? So we've classed the the reseal mm. bags. <laughs> it has to be, by the way, broadcastable. Okay, moving on to. <laughs> uh, ooh, look at these. See, that would be nice with your. Um, you could just have one of those, couldn't you, in the centre of your deal of the day? Either of them. But I've cut that strand. You should have one of those in there. Yes. Just one? Um. Yeah, I'd probably have just one. What would you? <laughs> How about one of each? <clears throat> or one of each. Maybe like a, <laughs> a, lemon, a lemon quartz, a garnet, lemon quartz, spinel. Lemon oh, quartz, garnet, oh, okay. lemon on this, quartz, on this, spinel. On this bit, yeah. Yeah. Alternate it. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, we've, I think we've already established that... Um, yeah, just use, treat them as, as, as uh, the, the actual deal of the day mm. in between to separate these big, huge spinels. Or have your little, um, little cluster at the bottom of the, of the spinels. Wow, that's our start price, but we're not stopping there. We're not stopping there. We're going to bring it to you on a Monday morning amazing deal. Um, 110 carats you're getting here. 16 by 10 millimetres in their size. So could we use these with the DVD that we filmed this morning? Yes, yes, you could do. And they'd be very good with, because you, um, you could do them with your prong setting as well, couldn't you? So yes. with, the, with your drill hole, if you wanted to use that. Those of you that just tuned in, we did actually um, do the relaunch on um, the birthday DVD that, well, what, or both of the birthday DVDs that Claire actually filmed um, that were in the box set, so we've we've brought them to you individually today. Um, so both of both of which you could use with these, couldn't you? Yeah, absolutely. Because you just you put your um, either do your prong setting or um, incorporate it with your wire weaving. It'd be nice with the, the gold wire that you've got there. Black we've and got gold coming up. Yeah. yeah. Is this your kit? No. I was going to say. It's an extra little bundle that oh, we're doing yeah. in a minute. 
Uh huh. There we go. My my husband said that the worst present I've ever bought him a sealable cork for prosecco. Uh. Yes. Yeah. Mm. The other thing you can do is you can put your teaspoon in, can't you? That's what I do yeah, but to carry on. it over to the following day. Like I said, <laughs> pointless. Just drink the bottle there. Hiya, Paula saying sharing. What's that? I'm an only child. My motto is, um, <laughs> is the only child. Oh, mine, mine, mine. Mine, 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 mine. Yeah, I agree. Mm. I totally agree. I totally agree. But, yeah, you know... Um, <clears throat> I have to say it to, like don't share Willow. You've got to share your chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Hiding in the fridge. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to share mummy? Share your Christmas mummy? Good girl. <laughs> no, you can't have any mummy. I'm only joking, I'm not quite that bad. Not quite that bad. <laughs> But yes, I agree. Yeah, I agree. Yeah, that's a bit pointless as well. I think that's pointless as well. Mm. Cork for a Prosecco bottle. Um, Okie dokie, we've got a little sneaky kit bundle coming up. But first, let's bring you a load of beautiful hemp cords. So, Kumihimo wish bracelets, you've mentioned mm. that today, haven't you, Claire? <laughs> <laughs> So, um, back in the day, we would use these for your macrame. <laughs> we would use these for your kumihimo. <laughs> your wish bracelets. <laughs> All of the above. Um, yeah, indeed. Um, and they are very, they're very fashionable, actually. <coughs> You know, I took a picture of, 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 of a bracelet which, which I bought for, it was a euro, literally, in, in Spain recently, um, just because I really loved the connector. And it was just a simple cord like this that you tied around your wrist. Yeah. Really yeah. worked. At 2 95 Roz is bringing them to you at. <coughs> She's become all really shouty all of a sudden then. Hey, Roz. <coughs> That's like um, doing your presents in those, isn't it? It's probably cheaper than how and you do it. We've got it some holidays coming up too. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah, perfect, not long. Yeah. perfect for your kids. Perfect for your kids to start kumihimoing. By the way, they'll pick it up like like within seconds. Um, your macrame as well it looks great in macrame, doesn't it? Mm. Really, really, really great yeah. in macrame. Um, all your little tassels. Don't forget, tassels are everywhere. Absolutely everywhere. I was wearing my tassel earrings yesterday, wasn't I? Am. Yes, yeah. Do love a tassel. Partial to a tassel. I like a tassel. Got 40 of them left. Well done. Oh, 8064465. Welcome. Have you got a favourite colour? Um, I was thinking the purple, and you've got purple opal, haven't you? So I think I, that's what I'm drawn to there. Yeah. That'd be quite nice. That is gorgeous together. In fact, I love it with those three. Don't you? Mmm. Yes. I do. Why do I feel like you're just, just <laughs> like, like. <laughs> No, mm. because I would give a genuine you response. No, you just went, I think about what mm. you say. No, I think about what you say first, rather than just saying, oh, I love it. I actually consider what it is that you're saying. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Mm. How's, how's, how's dinner, darling? Mmm. 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 Mm. What do you what 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 do you what do you think of uh, does my does my painting look like Monet? Mm. <laughs> yes, that happens I'll a lot. More, in my I'll be house. more enthusiastic. Now, does my okay? bottom look big in this, darling? Mm, yes. Um, mm, mm, mm. <laughs> That's more of a I don't want to answer. Mm. Yeah, awkward moment when your hairdresser asks you if you like your hair. I'm ready whenever you want to ask me. Okay, it's fine. Um, yeah, cheeky bundle coming in. <laughs> Are you ready for a star by? It's yes. half past 11. Yes, We've only got an hour and a half left in show, and I've still got loads and loads and loads to bring you. Okay, star by up next. <laughs>
Okay, right, all joking aside, we need to kind of get serious here because this is an amazing deal. Um, I'm about to bring you yeah, an amazing bundle of wire, which I will talk about in a, in a moment, but can I just say I'm kind of sidelining it for mm -hmm. a second. Um, right now, it's all about these beautiful cabochons. Now, I know many of you will look at it straight away and know straight away what it is. Um, it's a fusion of gorgeous reds and greens. Now, I've found out, I've learned something about this gemstone recently. I didn't know that ruby zoocyte glows under UV light. It's fascinating, isn't it? Yeah. It's lovely when you see, um, when you hear something new like that. It is, isn't mm. it? Because, you know, I, I, I never proclaim myself to know everything about gemstones. I definitely, definitely don't. Um, but yeah, this actually, this actually glows under UV light. I'm going to pick each of these up and show you, you have got, and I've, t uh, you know, I mentioned Monet and I mentioned it in sort of a, a joking fashion, obviously, earlier, but I always say that this gemstone looks very similar to that, doesn't it? Like the, uh, like the poppy fields. So I've got your, uh, your, your rectangles, I've got these really lovely cushion-like shapes, I've got this huge oval at the front here, um, I've got a really beautiful pear, and I also have um, a really lovely elongated, um, elongated rectangle as well. As you can tell, this one's my favourite, because I, I always find that I, I won't put it down, my favourite one. Um, but we're not just done there, because you've also got... It's what? Fuchsite. Really? Ruby fuchsite. Okay. I've never heard, I've never seen it before. Slight di a chemical difference. Okay, yeah. Is it still from the zoocyte family? It's still is a member of the zoocyte family. Okay, um, so the reason why I ask that question is ruby zoocyte, uh, tanzanite is a zoocyte, um, and yet many people actually don't put that connection together. Um, so the actual uh, sort of red elements are that, that beautiful, beautiful ruby color, ruby gemstone that's sort of coming through. Anyway, getting back to your wire, so you actually get 10 meters of your 0.8, you're getting four meters of your one millimeter, and you're getting 10 meters of your 0.4. Have you ever heard of ruby fuchsite? <laughs> I haven't. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lighter green. Okay, thank you. Um, but like I said, I th I'm sure many gemologists would look at this and actually see... <laughs> see Ruby Zoocyte. How many, how many of these do we have? 88. I've... <laughs> Right, 24 meters of wire, Rob, uh, Ros, in all seriousness, I, I heard what you were taking these to. And it's a deal, 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 jewelry makers, it really, really is. Um, yeah, if you're a lover of Ruby Zoocyte, I know you'll have seen that before. It's a variety of that, which gives you that gorgeous, I see where the name gets, uh, get, uh, where the gemstone gets its name. It's that fuchsia colour coming through, but it is still a member of the Zoocyte family. So it tends to be a lighter green colour, effectively. Um, I, I have literally just learned, and isn't it, I've, I've already confessed that I don't know everything about gemstones. Of course I don't, of course I don't. Um, so, 88 of these were available um, I know where it's going to uh, let's just say I think this could be one of the fastest selling items of the day so far anybody that wants to step into wire work perfect to get those wonderful gauges and one of the most popular colors but to be able to get hold of this gorgeous gemstone as well um, is, is a real treat I've never brought it to you before I've brought you ruby, ruby zoocyte but never never ruby uh, fuchsite um, in these lovely colors dial in as quickly as you possibly can um, it's completely and utterly natural so there's no treatment it's not been reconstituted in any way shape or form 300 and carat, uh, 300 carats of this wonderful gemstone from um, South Africa so your point eight your point wow. four and your one millimeter were you expecting that no I was that's, expecting a lot more than yeah that. that's yeah. why I was kind of get, trying to give you the little a little bit of a heads up never seen it before I've never ever ever seen it before it's it, it, it's got to be 
a very, very, a sibling, I'm going to say. Yes, yeah. A sibling of Ruby Zoocyte. Definitely. I'm thinking that you could put it with your, uh, your deal of the day garnet because that's going to like um, bring out the ruby tones, isn't it? In the... Oh, look but at that. But that. that combination of, um, of wire, you could do all sorts of your um, different settings, couldn't you? Your netting or your prong setting. I love them all. They're all absolutely amazing. Have you got a favourite uh, favorite shape? Uh, I do like this one because it's quite unusual, isn't it? That rectangular yeah. one. Amazing. Now we've actually got how many? One, two, three, four, five. You might get slightly more. Uh, you might get slightly less. As you can see, this one's got around. They're all larger sizes. Nineteen ninety-five. <coughs> Excuse me. For That's effectively really nice what well, is, well. Uh, effectively is, I don't want to say it's a gemstone launch. That's the back, is it? Yeah, so it's like, yeah. That is. It's really nice, isn't So it? when you get this home, if you want to test it, I imagine um, your ruby fuchsite will, will, will fluoresce the same way as ruby zoocyte does. Um, under UV light. Give that little, a, little, a little tester. Amazing, absolutely amazing. We had 88 of them available. We do not have um, that quantity anymore. If you want to multi-buy, you absolutely can. Uh, make sure you check out those baskets, though. Um, hello to you all, Dorset, Carmarthenshire, Sandra, Pippa. Hello to you, Tatiana, Carol. Multi buying going on there. I've, I'm going to do a little bit of homework <coughs> about uh, about this mm. this launch. That one's completely different, isn't it? It's like more block colour. Yeah, and it's shallower too. Because mm. uh, I mean, our capuchons will have differing depths as well, which lend themselves to different designs. It's beautiful, isn't it? Really does remind me of the sort of poppy fields mm. painting. Yeah. yeah, really does. Um, hello to you, Tegwin, saying stunning. Mm. Yeah, there we go, Jackson Pollock's painting. Yeah, I t uh, yeah, absolutely. It's it just incredible. It's Mother Nature's brush strokes, isn't it? Really gorgeous. I hope you managed to get hold of yours. Carol, well done. Debbie, well done. Good luck, I should say, Ella. Candy, good luck. Diane, good luck. I've got people on those phones. I've got multi buying going on. I think that's savvy. I can't guarantee. We had, a, we had an entire gemstone launch on Saturday night. Brand new gemstone that um, we'd never oh. seen before. Or I should say, a fusion. There will be, there will be an official launch coming up, yeah. Um, Um, anyway, and yeah, there is going to be an official launch of it as well. But, uh, but uh, technically speaking, we could do the same with this, couldn't we? That's what this is, though, Ros. Technically speaking, technically, um, because we had on Saturday night um, a gemstone ca oh, gemstone cabochons that were opal and chalcedony. Oh, wow! And they'd formed, they'd grown alongside one yeah. another and been cut together. Um, so this effectively is a different gemstone. It was a variation mm. of, effectively. Um, 1995 only, well done. If you like things of difference, then <coughs> you'll already dialed, dialed and already um, have uh, sort of confirmed. Well done. Uh, maybe get your certificate of authenticity if you want to actually have that documented too. Let's move on. Moving on to... Ooh, we're all about the micro today, oh, aren't yeah, we? Oh, yeah, that's perfect, isn't it? All about the micro. Here we go. I'll cut that one there. Okay. I shall hold it very. Oh, I shall hold it very carefully. I'll take, uh, that, take that bit off. Here we go. I can use mine. The lemon quartz that we had earlier on. My tassels got my tassels were in a twist. <laughs> Here we go, just pop those together. There we go. Oh, are. that's lovely. That's beautiful, isn't it? Alongside your deal of the day. We've had other microfaceted gemstones as well this morning, haven't we? Um, 6 95 only. Oh, see, I might have to get a few of these today. Claire did tell me that she'd cut it. Sorry. Yes. <laughs> but it just shows, doesn't it? It just shows how many are on that. How many are on, on that, that strand, yeah. exactly. Don't worry, that wouldn't happen with you. It's because we, not we, we Claire cut it and then I just... <laughs> <laughs> 
I just, just putting it on me. No, no, no. You told me. You told me that you'd cut it, and I just totally forgot and they've just gone everywhere um oh i still had some more in my hand look there is a lot on that strand isn't there yeah. they do go a long way look at that a vision of color a vision of summertime team it alongside your deal of the day absolutely beautiful would you go with the um, would you go with the garnet oh yeah alongside I mean, your next right. kit yeah that's a really pretty bracelet lovely isn't it beautiful beautiful strand of fluorite look at that so, so, so gorgeous. Watch this space. It's coming up in the next hour. These really lovely fluorite rounds and also um, additional findings. Yes. Yep. So, yep. yeah, stay tuned. Stunning kit coming up in the 12 o'clock hour. Um, how about a little int introduction of your, of your peridot, just to intensify those green hues if you wanted. Amazing. Well done. Check out those baskets. Right. Pardon? What are you talking about, Rose? Mookite puffy coins. Oh. <laughs> Ros wasn't making any sense then. I think the sleep deprivation has kicked in with her. So here we go. These are all the way <coughs> from the land down under. Your gorgeous mookites. Those wonderful selections of tones coming through. Um, your mustards. You get, uh, you get gorgeous um, maroon colours, reds. Um, milky light tones, right, very low quantity, Ros is saying. Be on the phone lines as quickly as you possibly can if you, if you love it. Um, and, and I know you and I have spent ages before actually going across an entire strand saying, oh, that one, look at this one, mm. look at that one. It's completely and utterly natural. Again, alongside your deal both, of the day. Both, yeah, yeah, both strands of deal of the day. Perfect edition. Mm. Perfect addition to seven ninety five. If you've got the deal of the day, you need to get this mookite strand. It's picking it out, isn't it? It I is. Mean, yeah, beautifully. Really, really is mookite. As I said, all the way from Australia, and it almost shows those those the, the mm. beauty of that location. I kind of think of Ayers Rock. I kind of think of the outback and the heat, the climate of Australia as well. Um, yeah, it's a gemstone that really does. So offer the beauty of the location. And the same way with the cabochons that you had in that, in that uh, mini kit. These are like little landscapes, aren't they? Absolutely. Yeah. You'll find, you'll find some art. which look like yeah, mm. Sahara deserts. You'll find some mm. which give you like a... Um, you can almost see the haze, can't you, of the heat almost, almost rising. Um, over allocated on this one, so check out those baskets if you want to guarantee success. Simple restranded. I think when you've got a pattern gemstone like this, it's very, very easy to um it, it's very easy to create a very uh, traditional simple make yet be a really 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 beautiful piece you know just yeah, not go to town yeah or go to town with say if you had got the deal of the day you could just sort of um do you like you see beading around each of them couldn't you prong setting mm. can do the prong setting if you got that yeah. dvd you know, make the most of that sort of flat coin like shape mm. prong set around it to create a solitaire ring yeah gorgeous love it well done limited quantity on that one um okay moving on to if you got the deal of the day you need this next one was to say Aww. okay can i just i reckon these are three mil personally i think they're bigger than what we're actually saying so but hey listen we'll, we'll stick with two um just by just because visibly they mm. look larger don't they um yeah I've seen this strand before. It's absolutely gorgeous. It's one of my favourite black spinel strands I think yeah. we have within the yeah. vault. And again, very, very workable. It's yeah. a good, good drill hole for the size of the size of the gem. Might I have might I ask the question, Roz, when was the last time I had this strand? Yeah, I thought so. It's memorable. It's really, really, really memorable. The amount of light luster that's coming across every single one of those facets is just amazing. Alongside the dealer day, alongside pearls, alongside any gemstone. Even maybe with the, the, other, the other strand of spinel that you had. Yeah. Like the ter even though it's sort of like that hasn't got the faceting, mm -hmm. so you're sticking with the same gemstone. Pop the two together. Wow. Really beautiful, mm -hmm. isn't it? It's, it, you know, it's something that... It is a real red carpet showstopper yeah. gemstone, isn't it? Yeah. Again, I've got to bring this into yeah, onto the back of my hand, just because it's all about the sparkle, mm. isn't it? 
all about the sparkle. What about the diamonds, Paul is saying? Yeah, I agree. Alongside your um, Australian diamonds, naturally coloured diamonds of that quality, they do deserve it. Um, if there's any of these left, come to the top of the show, I'm all over it. I'm 100% stocking it because I'm just thinking bracelets like, like this. You've got at least two of them. Look how wonderful yeah, and they look, are. See, that's, and that's the stacking effect, isn't it? Yeah. So you just, yeah, do all of those. That's mm. lovely. Um, and of course, because they are that little bit bigger, do you reckon you could get elastic sort through those? Possibly. Uh, well, I think that the elastic that we do is a 0 0.8, but you can get like a 0 0.5 as well. Can so you? Yeah. So you could possibly. Yeah. Well done. Well done, every single one of you. Up next, though, gosh, um, we have got next kit coming your way, but up next we've got a beautiful Cal Sedney. <laughs> It's got a semi-transparency, this gemstone. Mm. I love it. It really reminds me of kind of magical, whimsical, um, glacial-like scenes. It is your chalcedony. Chalcedony is a gemstone that comes in lots of different colours. Um, you can get white, you can get blue, you can get pink, you can get yellow. Sometimes they're treated. Um, in this instance, it's natural. But can you see how the light reaches the heart? But it does so in almost like a sort of snowy light colour, doesn't mm. it? So maybe perfect for your Christmas season, which I know many of our jewellers, that uh, jewellery makers that actually create, that sell their jewellery, will probably be already making Christmas pieces, wouldn't they? Yeah, so like your little, um, like could be like mistletoe berries, couldn't yeah, it? Or your nice. little snowmen. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. You have to work ahead, don't you, to make sure you, um, you know, you, you've got the stock levels, I suppose, for the seasons. Six ninety-five. There are very, very few uh, natural white gemstones out there. Very few. You can get agate. Sometimes those are dyed. You can get your pearls as well. But I think pearls is is uh, different because they've got um, obviously a different. How do I word this? A different texture, I suppose, to um, the likes of your agates, your your chalcedonies, you know, your um, your aquamarines, your beryls, those kind of things. Six ninety five. Um, simple stretchy bracelets. I'm thinking again. You know, we've had so many charms today. We have, and with the the spinel strand that you had before, yeah. that would be um, a nice sort of monochrome look. If you had that <coughs> on a craft fair, I reckon it'd probably be one of the fastest selling mm. pieces. Don't yeah. you? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, monochrome is very popular, isn't it? Indeed it is. Both of those have got, actually got the micro faceting as well. Sorry, the actual checkerboard faceting, I beg, beg your pardon. So um, you're going to get that same amazing performance going on. Yeah, if you want to get hold of that spinel strand, still currently available, I'm going to be getting some of those. And I'm going to be getting some of these. Well done to you all. Um, OK, before the top of the hour, we want to show off your amazing talents. In the next hour, we have got your demonstration. Beautiful, beautiful kits, more amazing star buys. The Wall of Fame is up next. Tale as old as time. I love this. Am I going first? Yeah. Right, yeah? Uh, 716. Look at this. Uh, oh, this is uh, Fiona in the call centre. Oh, I think I might have spoken to you, Fiona. Hi, all. Uh, I'm a member of, of staff in the call centre, so I appreciate... Oh, I cannot enter the competition, but I thought I would send in a picture of a seed bead rose I made as a housewarming present for my niece, who loves anything Disney, particularly Beauty and the Beast. It's made with 11 o seed beads on 0.4mm wire using French beading technique inspired by Joe Barclay Loggie's floral centrepiece DVD. Uh, as you would expect, all from JM except the bell jar. I hope you don't mind me sending it as I was quite pleased with the final piece and that's Fiona in the call centre. So that, yeah, that is amazing, isn't it? So I love to see, I love to see that, you know, so people that, you know, work in the call centre as well. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, thank you so much, Fiona. That's I need brilliant. to clarify just before anybody messages in 
Fiona's won't be entered into the competition because she's a member of staff. We're not allowed to. However, how lovely to see that wonderful yeah, work brilliant. of art. So lovely. thank you so much. But um, thank you. Uh, you're uh, number 716. Now, I have got amazing chain mail here. And it's coming from Bridget Briars wow. um, in North Wales. Uh, North Wales. Good morning, JM. Please find my entry to this week's Wall of Fame. I've decided to try a different medium every week. Wow, that's some challenge. Um, as you can tell from the photo, this week is chain mail. Um, it's a bracelet using rose gold and silver jump rings and a rose gold tea bar. The weave is called... Oh, gosh, have I, uh, can I pronounce that right? Griffin. Griffin, yeah. Okay. Um, is that right? Anyway, I hope you like it, and good luck to all fellow offers. Um, kind regards. Bridget, that's absolutely amazing. Sorry if we apologised it wrong. I've never seen it before. Mm -hmm. You're number 715. Look at this. This is beautiful. 718. Uh, and this is Josephine. Wow. Hi all at, at JM. My entry this week to the Wall of Fame is a four-piece jewellery set made with various size, beautiful pearls and silver chain and findings. Thank you all for brilliant shows and fantastic quality pearls and gemstones. Good luck to everyone in the draw. Thank you. And that's Josephine. I think that's Josephine Westwood because I think I recognise her beautiful work. It's gorgeous. That's amazing. Good luck. It's Wonderful. literally stunning. Absolutely Incredible. Stunning. Oh, as is this. Wow. wow, look at seven, that detail. Uh, 717 from Lynn Body in Oxfordshire. She says, hi all, please find attach my entry for this week. It's my first make um, of a CB butterfly necklace with a few peacock pearls. I enjoyed making it. Although it's not perfect and slightly large, I will enjoy trying again. Um, thank you for the great shows and tutorials. Oh, really? You're doing yourself injustice. That's absolutely amazing. Right, and yeah. why not make a big one? Mm. Fabulous. Right, good luck Gorgeous. to you. You are 717. 720, look at this wire work. Wow. This is Anne Messenger. Hi to all the JM team. Oh, wow. Please find my entry for the Wall of Fame. Beautiful abalone focal bead with cute little abalone discs in the chain from yourselves, teamed with copper wire. Good luck to all entrants and some for me, please. Lots of love to you all for your madness, keeping me cheered at present. Sincerely, and that's from Anne. That's amazing. It's a work of art, Anne. That's There's been a lot of madness tonight, today. Sorry, tonight, today. <laughs> A lot of madness. Um, 719 Ooh, is coming from you. Yeah, amazing. Irene Topping in, Port, uh, in Portadown, County Armagh, saying, Hi all. Um, this is my necklace made with peacock fre freshwater culture pills and seed beads. Love to all. Irene, that's absolutely incredible. With Beautiful. sterling silver, I can see. Stunning, Good stunning look design. Awesome. Look at this. So uh, 722, this lovely beading here. And this is from Hazel. Not sent, uh, sent anything for a while. I haven't had time to make much recently, but finally produced this. Reconstituted turquoise cap with seed beads. I hope you like it. Good luck to all in the draw this week, and that's from Hazel. That's beautiful. Really Love lovely. it, Hazel. Good um, luck. 721, some amazing wire work here. So clever. Oh, that's um, nice. It's from Candice. Hello, Candice, saying, Hi, all at Jim. I was blown away by the beauty of these Chrysocola cabochons. I've tried to wire wrap this one into a ring without uh, detracting too much from the stunning stone. Um, I used some of your lovely copper wire, which behaved very well. Thank you for the amazing gemstones and the inspirational demos that you offer. And that's from Candice. Well, thank you for sharing, That's lovely, Candice. Candice. I love it. Yeah. Great idea, isn't Gorgeous. it? It's kind of like interlocking Yeah, like knots. Fingers, yeah. It's lovely. Look at this wire work. Wow. Uh, 724. Oh, this is from Shirley Harris in Pembrokeshire. Lovely Shirley. Here is my entry for this week. The Dragon's Eye cab is from my stash, but all the wire I've used is from JM. Firstly, I netted the cab using 1mm for the base and 04 for the netting. Then I used the same wires to weave around the cab and make the bail. I think I got a bit carried away with the weaving, though. I hope you like it, and that's from Shirley. Shirley is beautiful. It's lovely. Love it. Um, well 723 done. is coming from <coughs> uh, Marie. Hello to you, Marie. Gorgeous. Um, hello, JM. Uh, for the Wall of Fame, I'm submitting this Labradorite necklace modelled by, uh, mo sorry, modelled on the left by Mr. Jackalope um, with a close-up of the necklace on the right. I use Labradorite. Is that um, like a rabbit? Yeah. It's a rabbit. Oh, yes, I can oh, no, see now. It's, it's a, yeah, it's, that's, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a jack, is it a jack rabbit? Oh, jackalope. I see, I see, I see. I used yeah. uh, labradorite faceted drops and rounds, uh, which I wired into the main part of the necklace and used lab nuggets, uh, which I rosary linked into the main chain. I finished it off with handmade hook and eye clasp. Yet again, all components that were from Fab J and Bargains. 
Um, so it's good luck to everybody. Uh, thanks to JM for um, just being JM. Oh, isn't that nice? Mm. Just nice. Uh, TTFN from Mr. Jackalope and Marie. Aww. Marie, it's absolutely gorgeous. Yeah. Confuse me for a moment then. Confuse yeah. me. Isn't he good lovely? Luck. Isn't he lovely? Good luck to you all and keep those entries coming in, jewelry makers. Um, we do love, love, love to see them. Right, I can just quickly squeeze in one more opportunity before we step into your next kit hour. Um, I'm going to bring you some gorgeous, gorgeous moonstone. Um, here we go. Um, it's going to be quite fast and furious on my part, but it doesn't have to be on yours. Um, we've got opportunities for you folks. We'll be popping the graphics on your screens, and just because we disappeared to a break doesn't mean that you've missed that opportunity. 340 carats here we are here of wonderful moonstone at just 5.95. Wow. That's a full 38 centimetre strand. I'd be making bracelets with those. Yeah? Hol yeah, holiday bracelets, definitely. Nice. Like the idea. Mm. Rosary linking in between maybe as well. Yeah, yeah, you could, yeah. It's a stash yeah. essential. And I've only just mentioned that there's very few, very few naturally white colour gemstones. And you get, I'm getting rainbows from yeah. some of these. Absolutely. Wow. Um, I've got to, uh, I've got to disappear. We're not going, uh, not going anywhere yet though. Quick break and then we'll be back with wonderful Claire's um, jewellery demonstrations and her amazing kit. And it truly is beautiful, mm. honestly. I've got real eyes on that one bracelet, Claire. Just saying, just saying. Um, we'll be back after this. <laughs> You can now book Jewelry Maker workshops online. Just head over to our Jewelry Maker website and click on the workshop link. We have a wide range of workshops from beginner to intermediate, covering a variety of mediums. Once you've found a workshop you would like to attend, simply click on the Book Now button, fill in the required fields, and then press Continue. This will take you through to the path.